This paper's pretty old. This paper's like two years old. Double. This doesn't. I don't know. I'm just not like I hate this. Does everybody struggle with this? I feel like I struggle with this stuff all the time. Just like getting the dimensions to be right. I'm sure everyone struggles with it. There's no true George. There's super geniuses out there who don't struggle with it. Never mind. I believe that. Last actions. Oh no, this doesn't work. Okay, uh, why aren't we going back to why can't I just predict the three together? Like, why don't I just group ARS together? Yeah, I see no reason why that wouldn't work. Because it's causal. <laughs> so the question is kind of where is the autoregressive nature? Uh, and they kind of don't answer that. In the, okay, so you put in a state, you get out an action, you take the action, right? Then you feed the action back in, that's great. That's normal GPT stuff, the reward, and then the state. The question is, is that all done autoregressive? When this samples the next action, no, because there's no sampling. I'm just gonna, this is dumb. I'm just gonna do this. Unless someone can tell me why I can't just do that. Uh, speak now or forever hold your peace. Why, why can't I just concatenate the dimensions together? Why does this actually have to be three steps of the transformer? Could it be a causal problem? Like there definitely is causal masking there, but it's not like those outputs are even used. So why are they not just concat? Why are they just not catted together? Can someone actually explain this to me? Wait. Twitch gave you a substance warning. Are people watching my Twitch, or are is there is there weed AI, which which detects if someone smokes weed on Twitch? Who, who bought weed AI? You know what I mean. It's like hot dog and not hot dog, but weed and no weed. If I, I we'll try vaping next stream and see if we get a contact warning. Wow. Well, at least they gave you a, at least they gave you a warning. Everybody should be entitled to choice. Um, my Chinese food will be here in 15 minutes. That's great. Okay, so you see what I'm saying? Like, can we just concatenate these together? I'm just gonna do that. That's so much simpler. Yeah, that's so much simpler. So let's concatenate them here. We can just do it at the dimension level. Let me just use that and have a completely separate head which predicts the output. So let's just do that. Unless, is there a reason I can't do that? 
Let's ask perplexity. Uh, that one's too slow. That makes no sense. I, I don't really get this. It's really hard to check if you implemented it correctly. I'm not trying to implement it correctly. I'm trying to implement something that works. Problem is, I put in a fake. No, I don't even need to put in a fake action. Well, like I said, what do I do about the first one? Let's have a yeah, I'll just make a fake action. Okay, so let's start thinking about it as A R. Right, and that's like a token. That's a token. Uh, the start action is always fake. I don't think that's going to affect anything. I might explicitly want to call it a fake action. I'll just do action space plus one. Um, and then I can probably do minus. No, I probably can't do minus one. We can't do that every time. The next time I put I put the real action in. Okay. Great. Put them in the right order. Uh, let's look at the shapes. Cannot expand. Oh. I actually want three. So batch time and then the thing. Okay, that's all right, that's fine. So then we'll concatenate them on the minus one axis. threes and these weird plus ones. Oh, okay, let's just copy that from GPT-2. Great. Yeah, BSC plane. Okay, great. Uh, I 
task, realize the logits. Yeah, select minus one there, because we're gonna want to train using that same thing. Uh, don't worry about that, because we're not training. Okay, why is that true? Oh, because I did count minus one. Uh, oh no, that's start pause, so that's right. Let's take a look at this. No, the mask is known. No, we need to keep that there. Okay, that's fine. This. It's just got so much simpler now we concatenate them. I, I don't understand what they're saying about the causal structure. Uh, it's very possible that cert not x dot requires graph, but I. Oh, that's annoying. Stupid stuff. Well, can I just not use GPT entirely? The only thing that I have to change is not is instance tokens variable? How could tokens be a variable? Oh, I see. Interesting, I didn't know we supported that. Well, that doesn't work anyway. Okay, this is not a trainable transformer. Uh, but okay, the problem with that You can actually set start pause to zero. Like I've had this problem before. Usually this avoids the JIT because the size is not, uh, we have bugs in this implementation. Usually you have, okay, so usually you have a, uh, a multi-headed, usually your first token is a long sequence. Like think about when you're using a chatbot um, or even when you're using a, a language model with a prompt, right? Your prompt is your initial sequence. And that initial sequence is why this works and why it doesn't work here. Uh, shouldn't I update the target reward? 
Yes, I do have to update the target report. Okay, and then we do rewards to go when we're training this, and this should all work. Um, okay, it's annoying that that doesn't work. It's, it doesn't like doing that initial sample. Let's take a look at what it's doing here. 192 mod something that's clearly a lot bigger than 192. I think I can just fix that. She had a test of symbolic for it. Okay, so symbolic is the back end that's used to render all these uh, shapes. After I smoke, it's harder to talk. But I think I, I still understand it. It's just like with like a different sort of vocabulary. At least I think I still understand it. Who really knows? Number like 192, and now let's mod it 384. And we expect the output to be 192 and just 192. Let's see if that works. Well, that's also a number, which is not fair. Oh, this doesn't work because 192 mod 192 is zero. So if start pause is zero there, that's zero. But if start pause is, that's stupid. You see why it doesn't like, you see? See how this can evaluate your two things based on the value of start pause? Um, it's not gonna work, is it? Yeah. So where do I pass in start pause? In here to the transformer block? function actually breaks that. Should we fix this in GPT-2 first? Should we fix this bug? thing. This is what's failing. Might be fixable. Something okay. Uh, no, part of the problem. Mm. 
think you want this to be zero. I think normally it can be zero. How do I deal with this in GPT? One if start pause else zero. It fails on the first run though, right? Do I need the cash? <laughs> it's very slow without it, and then we can't jit without it. This is showing me where tiny red's still not quite usable. I think my Chinese needs here. It is a glorious day for eating Chinese food. These are handful of noodles. Handful of noodles, a little bit of sauteed chicken, some vegetables, spicy. This is actually pretty authentic. I read stuff like this in China. And yeah, I'd shove my chopsticks in like that. I've heard it's offensive in Japan. But I'm offensive in America, so why should I change? That's not true. You should respect other cultures. That's really a terrible bug. I think we need to fix that. Let's replicate it in GPT. So. I can run this. Because hello is a single, a single, uh, yeah. You see, look, there's a replication of the problem in GPT. So let's fix it, boys. While we eat Chinese food, I'll move the mic back a little. You guys can hear the Chinese food. And wish you had some Chinese food of your own. The stream has been brought to you by Uber Eats. Which probably no matter where you live, you can get Chinese food. And if you live in California or New York or a place with a large Chinese population, you can get authentic Chinese food. There's so much to fix in Tiny Grad. I'm glad we're, I'm glad we're fixing things. By the way, this is the schedule you can see here in lower schedule item. One thing that would be cool is tying this back and like logging where each logging where each statement happened. That'd be pretty beautiful. Like how much time is wasted in Tiny Crab? Because people don't know. So yeah, the reason this doesn't work is if start pause started at one, that would be allowed. Uh, or if 1024 were bigger. And I think 1024 is bigger if you're doing, uh, if you have multiple tokens in your sequence. Extract the problem case to a test. Should not be in tests. 
symbolic. You can have in like a test integrated symbolic. This is probably pretty good. So there's the bug. Um, if I do this, it works. See, that's fine, but that's not fine. Uh, so we should think about why that's true and why this thing's not behaving as I want it to. Eating this chicken is difficult. of this eating can you see on stream? Should I get <coughs> a better camera? You have a hand cam? We can zoom in. Fix this in check track. just have to do that. Well, okay, wait, there's something we could do instead of division. I think we could subtract. What we've done so far first.
Would you like to see the eating? How many people? Oh, 890 people. Okay. So, the truth is this has to be zero. And, okay, maybe we can fix it here. Hmm. Either way, it's fully divided, actually. Because I'm not asking the question. Interesting. Okay. So it, it could be 128 or it could be zero. That doesn't matter. But how do I detect that generically? If A mod B equals zero. Actually, that probably shouldn't be true. There's other ways we can compute x for idx. I guess what we can do, well, let's look at what the shape is. Let's look at the whole shape. So it's this. Like, once we're here, can this just go away? I'm not sure. Why am I even checking this? 
real strides simplify merge adjacent. So it's in real strides. Oh, it's multi view. The problems go so deep. That should not be multi view. That's the bigger problem. So the only difference there. We have to shrink it. We have to remove the ones. You see the problem? We basically have to remove these strides or put those strides in, but without. Yeah. Um, so if it's a shrink, only if it's a shrink. I'm gonna write logic for this, it's stupid. This is so annoying. Then we have to put the want zeros back in whenever there's, you know what I'm saying? Is it correct? I 
do not know. <coughs> Is that stupid print and shape tracker? Okay. Wait. That still looks bad. Is the problem fixed in GPT-2? Sweet. Hello, security grants program. Hello.com. Looks like it works. Why does it still not work in Lunar Lander? That's the same bug. We'll get there. But this is a... Oh, maybe because I'm... No, the start pause is zero. That's a different problem. Hmm. Oh. Sometimes it picks two. It shouldn't be able to pick two. Oh, okay, wait, 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 we can have ignore value for sparse categorical cross entropy, I believe. Or maybe we just, um, it should not be able to pick two. Oh, I know what we do. Okay. So back to this bug. It's still in real stride. Let's see if we can hack this case too. It's contiguous. Oh, but that's 192. That's still okay. I think if it's a contraction. We'll write that more cleanly. I have a function called get contraction. That's just weird. Never mind. Okay. Okay, 
So that's a contraction from that one. Wait, that's not a contraction. Oh, those are just, okay, never mind. That's just fine. Does everyone understand what I mean by contraction? I will now go on to not explain what I mean. That sounds like it would take a lot of effort. Contraction is the shape of the, no, that's not actually what we want. Um, wait, it might actually be this stupid. Hang on, it might be really stupid. Uh, okay. Um, if length c else zero, if there is a length, we want the stride from c sub minus one. Oh, this is so easy. It's this. I'm 80% sure. Wait, that's hella nice. Yeah. It's almost worth it actually now, now that it's only two lines. Like it's a weird special case, but Duh. still an issue. Is it not a contraction? It is a contraction. Not even a valid reshape. Oh no, it is a valid reshape. <sighs> this is what we get for just trying to hack around the problem and not trying to fix it like adults. I ate all the noodles. More noodles. You see the problem with that, right? Like that's true sometimes. We can also probably make that a contraction.
Okay, so better question. Why is this not a problem for GPT? How did that become three? I just have weird parameters in here, don't I? And GPT that splits evenly. Okay, so what are the numbers from GPT? N layers, N heads is 12, DIM is 768. That doesn't seem so weird. Can't type. Well, it's definitely not a contraction. It's also not a contraction with GPT. Oh, I see. Okay, that's actually fine. No. Still doesn't work. Test, which I don't actually test anything. That's good. Let's get rid of that print. So a contraction is when your mother was nine months pre uh, a contra we're all just GPTs, man. So a contraction is when you have something like this and you're contracting it and you reshape it to this, right? And then the contraction is this, right? Does everybody understand why? Does everyone understand why that's the contraction? If you don't understand why that's the contraction, uh, ask your neighbor. Uh, we have office hours on Wednesday, and um, the TAs are very helpful. I will warn you though, the school is big on DEI, and some of the TAs did not receive their positions based on merit. Um, look, I, I'm not gonna single any TAs out by race, but I hope everybody has come to understand that DEI means that you have low expectations for a certain look of a person um and it's really a tragedy to that person it really is like you just have to prove yourself harder man and it just sucks and that's why the left are the real racists uh tune in to george hots tonight um we used to be on fox news now we've moved to rumble uh yes that's that's right rumble with an r um, it's like YouTube, but right wing, uh, but it's right wing, but we're going to repeatedly claim how this is the real home of free expression. Um, so yeah, uh, I hope everyone enjoys uh, my show. Uh, make sure to check out my key sponsors, uh, the uh, My Pillow Pillow and the uh, Shit Man. My pillow's gone. I don't know what we're gonna do, man. 
How are we gonna get funding to run our right wing show? I know. You can buy my male vitality supplement. Oh, supplements are over. Shit, I'm out of I'm out of ideas, man. I don't know what I'm gonna do. How are we gonna keep the doors open? I'm getting sued by those kids from Candy Sandy Hook, man. I'm getting sued by the Sandy Hook kids. What am I gonna what am I gonna do? Oh no, they're dead. It's fine. Jokes about dead kids. Don't sue me. Don't sue me. <coughs> um, it's brought to you by uh, Bud Light. Bud Light's trying really hard to rehabilitate their brand. So they're, they're going out there and sponsoring this far right content. Um, they're, they're very upset. Uh, that their sales are down. They thought they were just doing the right thing, but it turns out they weren't. Um, and they're doubling down on politicizing. Instead of going back to just a beer that you could normally drink, Bud Light makes a statement. And that is the real problem. Making a statement and caring. I hope everybody understands that that's the takeaway and that's the only way to survive the future. But that's what they want you to believe because if you're not out there making a statement and you're not making your voice heard, then it's easier for them to make their voice heard because that's how democracy works. <laughs> no, I, I have not watched Alex Jones on the... Uh, I only have so many hours in my day. I, I don't know about watching Alex Jones on the Joe Rogan podcast. Who am I voting for? Well, I learned a long time ago that, you know, when I supported Obama and when I supported Ron Paul and when I supported Trump and when I supported Andrew Yang, that sometimes you get the candidate you want and sometimes you don't get the candidate you want. But either way, nothing changes. And I'm sorry, Vivek, but... You know, like, like you're the first year that I, I'm just, I'm just, I just know that nothing is going to change and I'm not going to get my hopes up, man. President Nikki Haley, here we come, you know? That's right. Yeah, Ron Paul was a winner. Yeah, I know, I know. Um, but they all turn out to suck, right? George, how did you ever vote for Trump? Well, he turned out to suck. George, how did you ever vote for Obama? Well, he turned out to suck. They always turn out to suck, man. And that is the truth. You just you just can't get your, your hopes up, man. And yeah, that's why. And then how do old people still vote? I mean, I guess you really just have nothing else to do uh, when you're old. But yeah, Vivek gets my year of indifference, unfortunately. Uh, does he sell hats? I did, I, did, I did buy hats from all the other ones. I didn't buy an Obama hat. I did not have an Obama hat in 2008, and that's because I used to be poor. But I did have a Ron Paul hat, a Trump hat, and a Yang hat. <laughs> if Vivek sells hats, I'll buy a hat, okay? How old are you, boner pull? Okay, why are we printing this? Where is that printing? Oh, it's printing here, okay. You know, the other way around, we want... Yeah, no, really, Ron Paul. Like, Ron Paul is the guy. Is he dead? Is he dead? If he's dead, we can say all the great things about him we want and talk about how much we loved Ron Paul. If he's not dead, he still has room to disappoint us. Yeah, no, uh, really, this, you, you, you can just, you can just, there's simply one way to tell if someone's the good guy or the bad guy. And, and it's, do they support the surveillance of Americans? Right? That's, that's it. That's it. Like, how could you, like, that should be so far beyond the Overton with, oh my God, you know, I mean, if, if, ugh. We still have. Did they, did they repeal the Patriot Act yet? No, they did not. Um, uh, Ross Perot. I'm sure I would have been. I'm sure I would have been a Perot fan. Um, I, I was. A, I was a. I was a Gore fan in uh, 2000. 
Uh, in 2004, I was just devastated by what an idiot Bush was. You know, look, this is like the normal, this is the normal trajectory of the manipulated American political system. And then you just learn to be a nihilist and realize that nothing you're going to do is going to change things. But that's not even how things change to begin with. Would things really change if Charlie had died sooner on Lost? Yes, the show would have been better because that guy sucked. Okay, I was so happy when Charlie died. That was finally, they were listening. Spoiler alert, if you didn't watch season three of Lost. <laughs> I don't know, look. <laughs> you, you, you. Okay, all right. You ready? you ready for how the trick works? There's this thing called the government. And then there's this thing called the deep state, right? And the deep state, sorry, I said right. Deep state is actually what runs the country. But you don't elect the deep state. You elect the government. The government goes on TV and talks about how are we going to let this happen again and that we need to do something and protect the children. The deep state, uh, you know, sends billion dollar wire transfers to weird places in the world and like brings Hunter Biden as hookers, right? That's, that's what the deep state does. But you don't vote for them. You vote for these guys over here, the government. So then you get people over and over again who are like, well, I'm going to vote and I'm going to make change. But it turns out you don't vote for the guys who actually have power over here. You vote for the guys over here who are puppets. And they're not even puppets in the sense that they're being controlled by somebody to do something. They're just over here playing. Do you think that anybody lets Nancy Pelosi near any real levers of power? Probably yes. And that's the problem. Uh, what's the difference between the PMC and the deep state? Um, I think they're the same thing. I think like the PMC is more of a, I, I think that the deep state is made up of PMC members. Um, by the way, the deep state is not a conspiracy. Uh, don't let, don't let people tell you that the deep state's a conspiracy. The deep state is, you can find all their names on the internet. It is all the unelected bureaucrats. It's all the people who just hang around in Washington, D.C. It turns out if you just stand next to the guy long enough, you, you just you know how things work, and that's what these people have done. And they don't die because we have uh, high blood pressure medication, and they're all on that shit, and they're all on that, like like what are, what are those things called? You know, statins. They're all on statins, and now they don't die, so we don't have a natural cycle of turnover in this country. And even if we did have a natural cycle of turnover in this country, who would we turn it over to? Who would we turn it over to? There's nobody because the pyramid ended. And that is why I'm investing all my money in Nigeria. Look at Nigeria. They have a pyramid. Nigeria still knows how to build pyramids. In America, we forgot in 1971. Um, I'm, I actually have money on Biden, so we got to root for Biden, guys. We're riding with Biden on this channel. Um, I think I got good odds on Biden. Okay, this works. We just need to make the JIT work. Always use the jet.
Okay, I think it's faster now. Okay, 20 milliseconds a step. That doesn't sound too terrible, is it? Actually, that might even just be because it's render mode human. Might be even faster if I just added that. Great, it's fast now. Love it. Gotta use the JIT, boys. Are you using the JIT? Uh, wait, no, 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 no. Why is that back? Oh, because I got rid of channel plus one. Get on the stairs this morning. Are you using the jit jet? Yeah, I'm using the jit jet. Of course, I'm using the jit jet. You gotta get your jets, boys. Yo, I heard you like jets. Okay, that looks pretty good. It looks like it takes the actions equally. And that's what matters, equality, guys. The actions don't have to be good as long as you have a diversity of zeros and ones. It doesn't matter if the actions actually keep the cart pole balanced because we achieved our goal of diversity. <laughs> I've never been to Nigeria. I do know that they have a much more functioning looking uh, pyramid than we do. Uh, by the way, Africa documentaries. I'm gonna. Oh, that's what I'm gonna do today. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna write decision trends more. We're gonna smoke some more, and then we're gonna watch Africa documentaries. <laughs> How does anyone take anything seriously anymore? How does anybody? This is also wrong, I believe. Oh, I count equals one answer. Why do I have count like that? Why don't I just make count zero? And then I can say zero, one if count. Yet you meet people and they still take things seriously. So this can generate, we'll say that's good, that's good, roll out env. The Wokies are great, boys. The Wokies are great. Who said I can't stand Wokies, okay? I'm not complaining about the Wokies, man. I'm complaining about the people complaining about the Wokies, okay? They, had to, they, they cared, and that was the, the problem, man. I'm complaining about myself, okay? I'm the pro. It's me. Hi. I'm the problem. It's, it's me. White men, straight white men are, are the problem. Wow. If we just, if we just like went to space, shit would be pretty cool. You know what? I had an idea a few nights ago and we should turn Earth into a nature preserve. Think about it. A lot of people win in that scenario. Earth has so much natural beauty and biodiversity that humans should fuck off to space and leave Earth to be a nature preserve. Was my cross? I'll go get my cross. That's a good point. I've been wearing my cross, but I showered and I didn't put it on.
We're, we're not gonna, the cross is on under my sweatshirt. We're not gonna show it on stream because we don't want to uh, offend people of other faiths. Is this yes to agree work with it? No, but this ends with tanks on the Harvard campus. This ends with tanks on the Harvard campus. Wow, did pretty well that time. Should we just give up on transformers and just use an evolutionary algorithm? <laughs> Japan is very cheap right now. Um, maybe I'll go chill in Japan for a bit. It sounds nice. Just want to append the reward there. Oh, we want to compute rewards to go. Do I have that code in beautiful card pull? Do I not? Discounts. Oh, I have to, uh, I have to compute that. I can copy this line. What is that? Yeah, it's cold. And I didn't use enough energy today. I wanted to use more. Pretty sick return, 109. Wait, I did not get booted. I did not get thrown out of any colleges. I quit both RIT and CMU, and at CMU, yes, I had a 4 up. I tried. One of the first times in my life I tried it. That's pretty good. Uh, wait, we can't just do that. We also have to pass in model. Model. Pass in model too. Okay, sweet. Uh, great. Now we just need to generate a whole bunch of them. Then each one is a is a episode for a transformer. I think that's batch size. I'm gonna have to pad it, which kind of bugs me. Or should we just, like that's just the reset action and we'll just concatenate all this crap together. Kind of sounds better. Let's concatenate the crap together. Let's concat we can concatenate crap together. We'll call them BR, BS, and BA. Yeah, I love my names. BR plus equals R. Mm, we gotta make sure these don't go NumPy. Oh, this is like kind of NumPy, that's fine. And then actions are not NumPy, okay, good. While length and 
BR less than, I don't know, 128. Does this work? Missing mismatch of barbells? What the hell is that mean? Oh, I have to reset the jet. Damn, homie. In high school, you were the man, homie. I think it's called reset. I don't exactly know why we have to reset it, but we just do. Oh, this crap again. Oh, because we also have to reset the stupid. We should actually probably contribute to. I was thinking about this. For this, we probably want to say if start pause dot val equals zero instead. Great. Okay, we're running episodes. I'm so happy we concatenated them. That makes life a lot easier. Uh, okay, br equals We can also, if we wanted, do the mask. So we like mask the episode separately, but I don't think it really matters. Like just if you give up, like just reset. Uh, and it can't generate that action, so great. Oh my God, is college worth it? Guys, do you know what a MOSFET is? Why is this one so big? Oh, because I have a hundred as the default. It should be zero. This is the most incredible. Decision transformers are brilliant. You just put in the reward you want to get. That's so cool. Well, we can also roll out multiple at once. I think. I don't know, that sounds like a lot of effort. Chinese food was great, but you know what would be? Wait, where'd my Chinese food go? I right, put it over there. You know what I really want? A cinnamon roll. Want a cinnamon roll? Oh my god! You know, I, oh, it's 
I don't know if it's better or worse that everyone talks about the, the, the oh, being anti the woke stuff is as bad as being the woke stuff. The liberal arts woke study. At the, we, we aren't even close to like. There's like a Maslow's hierarchy of bullshit, and we're still at the level of like figuring out. Yudkowsky's right, guys. Yudkowsky's right. Our civilization was faced with a test, and we lost. We lost, okay? And now we just have two choices. You can either be on the do things team or on the don't do things team. And I don't know, I like things. I think we should do them. Ugh, this is subscribers talking. See, this is the problem. I, Leo, I love you for gifting subscribers, but the, the problem is you should get a star with an asterisk next to it if you're gifted a sub. Or, I don't know, actually, I, Leo, I might be blaming the wrong person. You might have carefully picked those 20 people and determined that they were good people. And that's probably good, because I trust subgifters a lot. Um, let's order, I would order an apple pie empanada, but they got rid of, uh, oh, the guy, this guy who DM'd me yesterday wants to do a phone call to be intern for Tiny Grad. Um, All right, let's see. I'm streaming right now. Are you okay with the interview being on stream? Wait, what do we think about that? Should we do an interview? No, I think that's actually, let's see what he says. <laughs> uh, no, I shouldn't do that to people. That That's pretty terrible. And yet they're okay with it, but like, I, I'm curious what he says. He should say no. But if he says yes, that's that's ballsy. But we can't just we can't just like use people for content. That's tech. Then I'm no better than any other. Ugh. Did he solve a bounty? No, but he did a few PRs. I want donuts. Okay, I want a cinnamon roll. I won't eat the whole thing. I just want to look at the cinnamon. Wow, wait, Cinnabon can deliver to me? 11.49. Donut bar. Krispy Kreme can deliver. Chief Lee Cafe. Basic waffle, bonbon croissant. Can we just order a single Cinnamon roll? Like, that's kind of savage. I'm just high and want to order things. Wait a second. This cinnamon roll? This cinnamon roll costs $9.50. Let's buy it. Utensils. I don't get my... Oh, fine. I won't get my Uber One discount. I'm not buying more stuff, okay? I'm getting a 950 cinnamon roll. Let's see what we get. Thank you, people who purchase subscribers to fund my stupid. Uh, wouldn't be comfortable being on stream. No, nah, I don't think I don't think that gives a signal either way. I'm, I'm just curious. Okay, 
That took a really long time to generate. Um, but this is the batch size. Why did I order cinnamon roll? I was just high and ordered a cinnamon roll. Okay, we're making bad choices today, guys. Bad choices. Just because you're self-aware about your bad choices doesn't make it any better. Just because you say things and it's sarcastic, but you can't just chase the irony. You can't just chase the, the, the stuff all the way down. Something has to be real. Something has to. Okay, because if, if nothing's real, then nothing matters. And if nothing matters, you can just die. And if you can just die, like, why don't you do it already? Trigger warning, self-harm. You gotta click through that link, bros. You gotta click through. You gotta. Get... How does anyone take it seriously? You know, like, I, I guess they're trying. I, I guess, oh. And I'm just mocking the people who are trying. Postmodernism is fucked, but how do you, you can't get out of postmodernism. You can't, you'll be stuck in postmodernism forever. You won't really, but like, like the gradient, like you're on one of those, you know, you know what I'm saying? You're on one of those, like, like in the gradient, like we, we can't get out. It's just, just, just a postmodern hell. Like in order to get out, people have to die. And I don't mean that in like a war sense. I mean that in like a generation change sense. You do know everybody dies, right? Like that's what they never told you during COVID. Like you're going to die, right? Are you that worried if it's tomorrow or, you know, 50 years from now? Does that really matter that much to you? What's the difference between now, 50 years from now, and the heat death of the universe? Like the second, the first two were so close together compared to that second one. I'm sure you're gonna have some gamma decay on it because, but but you still know what I'm saying, right? We're, we're playing for the whole fate of the universe. There's a whole, like like the, the future of light. The light cone happens now. Or do we just feel that way? I mean, is that true? I don't know. Like again, like it's it's one of the, it's like saying if if you know you're. If you think that you're crazy, you're not crazy. If, if you're aware of the fact that everyone who makes these apocalyptic doomsday, doomsday predictions is an idiot, then why don't you look at yourself and treat yourself just like the Mayan calendar, right? Why do I think the singularity is gonna happen in 2038? Am I just as bad as the Mayans? It's not even a date that has any significance. It's just the Unix timestamp rollover. Like literally how stupid is that? But it makes more sense than anything anyone else is saying. And, and the question is, is that because I'm crazy? Like, why does it make more sense to say that the singularity is gonna happen in, in uh, 2038 than to say Joe Biden is a great leader? Why does, why does the first one make more sense? What's wrong with me? Dada, thank you for gifting subs. Do you have a question? All right. It's like we're learning. It's a little slow, but we're, we're learning, hopefully. All right, let's turn on... Training, true, no grab, false, um, model... BRBS BA A logits equals A logits dot sparse categorical cross entropy BA. It can't just be that. No, it's not that. It's that. That makes more sense. All right, decision transformer, make decisions. Can't just be zero, it's gonna be variable, start pause zero. All right, all right.
let it happen after I die. That's that boomer logic. Um, input tensor shapes cannot be multiplied. Well, that's upsetting. I would like them to be multiplied. Actually, I'm not sure if I'd like them to be multiplied. Okay, this is probably wrong then. Uh, oh, I think I have to do this. T dot grad is not none. I don't know about that. I haven't watched Cowboy Bebop. I should do that. Okay, why are some of the gradients none? Set no grad to false. Uh, we're not using the jet. Actually, let's just explicitly not use the jet. I can do dot forward here. Then we're explicitly not using the jet. Cert t dot grad is not none. I mean, I did loss backwards. I don't know what else to say. I set no grad to false, maybe, but maybe something's wrong there. The live action? She likes anime mostly. We watched Jujutsu Kaisen. She liked that a lot. Okay, we're getting an assertion that the gradient is none. Uh, it's because it's not computing the gradient for some stuff. And why is that? Oh, no, that's going to be after. I wish I could know which one that was. Again, this comes back to like the tiny grad needs like the, the tiny grad introspection project will happen. Error none. Well, obviously it's none. Oh, I think I do some caching in. Uh... Maybe I don't explicitly say that it doesn't require a gradient. Uh, 
shouldn't require a gradient. Shouldn't require a gradient. Do I have any advice? <laughs> you are late, and if you're asking me that question, you're never going to get better. And that's the truth. Do you want the truth? That's a dumb question. Do you think anybody who's any good asks that question? And I'm just, I'm just going to be honest. Like, I don't have an answer for you, but it's a dumb question. And I get emails like this all the time. Do I have any advice, right? And we're going to be harsh about it. We're going to be harsh about it because guess what, guys? We're in the end times. You know, does it matter? No. Like... You know, I, it kind of upsets me. I, I think the quality in the Tiny Grad Discord is going down, and partially it's because of these streams. Here's my harsh tone. Uh, and, like, in some ways, I get it. Streams, th these streams are not particularly, like, this is not my job, right? I'm, I'm here, I'm, you know, I'm smoking weed on a Saturday ordering $9.50 cinnamon rolls off of Reeds. Um... So they're not high quality and they don't really attract. Would I watch my own streams? Yeah, maybe like something, sometimes. Honestly, I'd probably watch clips. I don't think I'd sit there for eight hours and watch a stream. And that's kind of the, you know, the line of the little Dicky song, Professional Rapper. He's like, you know, the shit that I'm bumping wasn't the shit that I'm making. And that's the truth. And that's, that's, that's on me. You know, I don't know, like, like make content for me to consume. Something's gotta, yeah. I've been doing this. I've been trying to get into having a schedule lately. Going to work every day, put in ten hours. You know, put in, put in, put in ten hours, put in twelve hours. Uh, into working. Make time you got better. Come home, sleep, do it again the next day. On Saturdays, stream. Sundays, either go to work or try to do something with Alex. Uh, then on Monday, go to work again. A schedule. I don't know. It doesn't have any answers for you. It's answers for me. It's answers for what the stream becomes. You ask me for advice. Well, why don't you give me advice? That sounds better. Ask not what this stream can do for you, but what you can do for this stream. This is probably, oh, this is the time embedding. Wait, did I delete the time embedding? Oh, well that explains it. Great, we found a real bug. Okay, we are learning. Oh, the last last one up. Oh, I love this learning. Oh, don't we love learning? So what's the initial return? Zero. I'm just gonna flip the order of the match. Oh, this is actually a reward, is it not? What is m dot reset return? Do you get a reward from the first time step? I guess you don't. But yeah, notice how I never trained on that one. Um, yeah, and also, this is not what I should be putting in there. 
Let's look at the decision transformer paper. It's here. Okay, R. Well, no, but that's not right. Um, okay. Let's target a return of 50. Target return minus equals reward. Okay, well, my loss went to zero very fast. I mean, maybe it's predicting the same action every time. Maybe we have no diversity. Oh yeah, no, that's definitely true. Also, move to Nigeria. Move to Nigeria and have three children. So I don't understand how that's zero so quickly. Um, So very quickly, it converges to just predicting a single action every time. Actually, after one after one update. Oh, um. Make sure actually P one is the rest of it. converges to 90% and you can see that that's the episode line so they're very short it converges to 90% zero does sometimes it converge to 90% one let's reduce the learning rate Okay, well, at least reducing the learning rate doesn't make it collapse anymore. Okay, it doesn't seem like it's getting better. Um, Should also probably calibrate that. So now it's getting sixty eight. Okay, let's like discount this. One. Oh, well, that's just dumb. Uh, 
That should not be the reward. I don't really understand why it's outputting that. Like this should just be the real returns from the thing. It should not be that. How is target return getting into R? Because it clearly is. Oh, because I put it in R. That's not good. Maybe we don't train on that first one. It has a fake action too. But I kind of like the fake action. Did I do this backwards? No, that's right. We never train it to predict the fake action, which is what works. But the reward should not include target reward. Yeah, okay, maybe this just shouldn't be target return. It should just be zero. That can stay target return. You can print target return here. Uh, okay, so that's probably not. We want the target return to be like the most it's ever seen or like what it converges to. Come back to 99, it actually discounts pretty fast. What's the convergence of the power series of 99? Um, there's like some way to calculate that, right? We can calculate it. Oh, it's just like it's the sum of that, though. There's probably some expression for that equation. Target return is 20, and we'll change that to be a discount factor of 95%. Okay, that goes negative, which should not happen because we need to discount the target return. You don't want to discount it. I don't think they discount it in there, so I'm not really sure how to take that into consideration. But actually, in some ways, maybe we never change the target return. Maybe we don't do that, actually. Do they change the target return? Hmm. 
No, this should work actually. That's fine because that's like the max. This is because we're discounting. It actually should work. Okay, are you learning how to be better or not? My batch size is very small. Just get lucky with those big numbers. Okay. Uh, let's reduce multi rollout to 64. Increase batch size to 4. So each one of those are the episodes happening. You see, this one's converged to zero. I thought a bigger batch size would help. It did not. You want to turn on render mode human so we can watch it not balance? Is it learning? Do we think it's learning, boys? See, look, it's collapsing. Look, see, I'm printing the probability of each state. So it's just learning to spam one. Now it's forgotten. Okay, so here's another cool thing. This is an off policy, uh, this is an off policy algorithm. So we can do some amount of, uh, of replay. We don't have to, sorry, not replay. I'm not sure this helps, but like maybe it does. You have to not be so cynical. Don't insult the guy who posted some big long rant in your chat expecting a real answer. You have to you have to just have a positive outlook on people. You know, you catch more bees with vinegar than you do with bee zappers.
I guess I don't actually want to do multi rollout. I want to like just stick these all together. Um, Now we just like, I don't know. It's actually stupid because like we don't actually need that context. That was a pipe reward. Where am I piping it to, bro? Pipe, 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 pipe. pipe. Just like, what if we just normalize it? So you say like AI could probably be typing this for me right now. It probably could. I think the bigger problem with that is it's not like I'm doing nothing with this time. I'm actually thinking. Like I use a different part of my brain to uh, Not actually what I want to do. Um, Okay. 
point one. What doesn't work about this? Oh. So there's that problem. I can reuse B8 in there. Okay, it's learning. It's machine learning doing a shitty job of it. It's time to always predict zero. Okay, my hyperparameters is, uh, let's raise the temperature. Didn't fix it. So we're, we're making each, we're clipping each one to be only 20. Like, let's take a look at a sample. So like that's the reward, these are the states, and then those are the actions. Um, those ones don't look clipped. I don't think that worked. Clip R not work. It did. Oh, I don't know. Okay, they're definitely there. That's fine. I, don't know, I guess we were just looking happened to look at a sample that was bigger. Yeah, it's just jamming zero as hard as it can. Now here, sometimes it looks like it's predicting one. At least in that. Oh. We're never deleting them. Whatever. With my overpriced cinnamon roll. Nine minutes away. Wait, is it learning to balance? At least it's at least it has diversity. Very important. Wait, it kind of is working. That's how you feel? Your feelings matter. Feelings matter, bro. Feelings matter. Is it learning? I don't know. You know how you can know if something's learning or not? Ooh, 70. You can use a graph.
Okay. Let's first do a short one to make sure I didn't mess up the plot. See, you can't just count on that 60. That was all just luck. Okay, it's just going to warm up a bit before it starts training. Get some random noise. Still all in random noise land. Wait, no, it's not. Oh. Okay. Now we're learning. We're doing two episodes every time. Okay, oh, plt.show. Good thing I didn't run the big one. Um, I mean, maybe, can I do this here? What does that give me? It's gonna hang after I do plt.show though, right? Okay, for some reason all my returns, oh, they're all 20, damn it. It's not what I want. Okay, good. Well, that was a quick way to see a mistake. Um, if I do that, but I don't hang, does that just like do what I want, which is like show the plot without? No. Oh, I think there's an argument to plt.show. Um, block, yeah. So far, it's doing worse. Oh. Let me just make that wild one again. PLT.plot returns, it seems fine. All right. Will it learn? It's not even getting longer anymore. That was supposed to be getting bigger. Are there other figures hiding? Hidden figures, might you say? PLT.clear. How do I PLT update a thing every loop? PLT plot update in loop. Figure.canvas.flush events. That's a lot of work. Oh, do I have to do figures? Okay, fine. We'll make a figure. Uh, Figure.canvas.draw. Mm. Oh, this is too much work. PLT dot pause. There we go. Oh, oh, is it going to learn? Will it learn? It looks like it's getting stupider. Medea goes to the moon. Was that a Medea movie? <laughs> I believe it. I don't know. Reinforcement learning takes forever, but it also may be doing nothing. We do not. Ooh. Wait, is it learning, boys? No, it can't be learning. That's too optimistic. If you stare at an RNG long enough, you'll start to see God.
Well, okay, so here's something we can do. We don't actually need to watch it try to balance. It should be faster without that. Um, what's that stupid print? All these prints. Yeah, that's the most disgusting code I wrote in here, okay. This is faster now. Are you learning? Is you learning? Learn better. Oh, I know one of the problems. Okay. So because we're clipping things to 20. Yeah, that sucks. Um, because we're clipping things to 20, it's gonna have trouble when it starts to try to roll out past 20. So let's clip it to 50 instead. Like I thought it would be okay, but it might just get confused. think it's actually learning anything. You see, look, when it goes past 50, it gets angry. I don't know. I might just be staring at a random number generator. Probably. Where's my cinnamon roll? So this is kind of a tiny thing. Okay. Let's do four. We learn how to play card pull. There's so many pieces in here that could be broken. I have very low hope. You see why it should predict better actions? It's because I'm putting in, I'm telling it that you want to get 20s. Has never actually seen a 20, which is also kind of unfair. Let's just tell it you want to get 15s. I mean, it's probably directionally correct, so it's probably fine. Those rewards are, hang on. We might just be doing this too much. It's back to 50. RNG says you're just going to get some good sometime. What we're looking for is a uh, steady up, upward progress. And we're making sure we keep the diversity. See, these aren't very diverse. I don't want to start adding crap like entropy regularizers. I don't know. There's so many ways this could be broken. All right, let's see if it learns how to fly. Let's just give it a harder problem and see if just maybe magically it'll work. I mean, it won't, but I got to get my cinnamon roll anyway, and you guys can watch the lunar lander while this thing doesn't uh, work. Hasn't even started learning yet.
Okay, now I've started learning. Let's see if it learns. Will it learn? cinnamon all look yeah not very good nine dollars uber eats is such a scam man let's see how it tastes terrible i paid nine dollars and fifty cents for this Is it learning? Do we think it's learning? Oh, we're also not looking at the rewards there. We should probably look at the rewards. Did I mask the first one like I said I was going to, or did I not? I just put zero in there. Okay, fine. You feel like it's worse than random, no? Huh? <laughs> That's very possible. There's many things that are worse than random. I'm gonna have to think about how to build tools to debug this. So, I don't think it's being trained on predicting the next states. Because the only output from the transformer is the actions. Select hidden states for action prediction tokens. It's crazy, there really is only loss for the actions. The loss is going down, sort of. The loss is good, but that just means it's good at predicting failure. Yeah, the loss is now almost zero, and predicts the other action. Okay, let's go back to a small one.
Could it just not be working? Could I have a bug in like the JIT and stuff? That's that's probably the first place to look. No, I don't think we have to implement it in Torch. I don't think it's a tiny red bug. I'm saying that there's... I'm saying that the... Uh... The, my implementation's wrong. Not not the code in TinyGrad, but the code outside. So, how do I possibly debug that? Let's look at the hugging face blog. Okay. Happy interface. From other agents or human demonstrations. the last k time steps into the decision transformer three inputs return to go state action you know what I mean it might be a little confusing how we're uh, like how we're adding the positional embedding. No, that should be fine. The prediction is conditioned, oh, on up to 20 previous frames. Oh, interesting. with a window of the previous 20 time steps. So they're not doing rollout forever. But I don't really care about that even.
Let's just try something stupid. What if I set the target return to zero? Okay, that immediately collapses. Well, let's set the target return to like eight or whatever that is. Okay, that collapses to zero pretty quickly. So now if we set the target return to like 50, It still kind of collapses. <coughs> I don't think that code is wrong. We're putting in one sequence per I guess something I could do is a sanity check also predict the state. There's nothing fundamentally that makes them logits, right? No. It's just it's just a dimensions. In fact, I could even move that whole head one out if I wanted. <coughs> Min 20 highest found, what? Oh, are you actually getting that from somewhere? Yeah, okay, we can do that. Let's actually do like a 90th percentile or something. Why is it sometimes printing a really small number? Where, where does that print? What is that tiny number? It's not the target return. Oh, that's the loss. Why don't I label my numbers? Simple write this in a minute, it's kind of disgusting. Um, well, will the reward embedding make you choose a good path? Well.
don't want to pitch it on equals. Why do you not learn? Try something else. This isn't right. We really want random uh, choice. I write this all the time. do that without replacement. <sighs> Whatever. Does replacement matter? That disgusting cinnamon roll. That was terrible. See, I get excited when it goes up, but you gotta learn how to not do that. Put this in the fridge for later.
Okay. Hopefully we can see that it clearly does not learn. Did I implement the sliding rollout? I don't know what that is. Okay. How can we check this for bugs? The loss doesn't even look like it's going down that much. It does seem like using the larger replay buffer, the loss isn't going down anymore. that helps all right so here's the loss it doesn't look like it's really learning Same one from each one. Let's just print this. Shouldn't do anything weird. No, that's fine. I'm sure we can also get rid of this. Like, why did train with the same ones at first? Doesn't matter. This is lost. We want this to go down. Oh. So, I don't understand. These things are not logits. To sparse categorical cross entropy. No, I think it includes. I don't think I need that. I think it includes a thing. No, self is a logits input. So this actually just might be wrong here. Because that might have to be log softmax. Argmax is still the same. I'm not sure how much this matters. Let's look at the logits. OK, 
Okay, they're definitely lodgements. Uh, and then if that's in log space, we don't divide by temperature. We subtract the log of temperature. Let's see if that sounds right. But again, <coughs> that isn't going to affect this. Those things are logits. We're predicting the next action. That's right. And yet now my loss goes up. It is true that it's a non-stationary distribution. Those don't look like logits now. What the hell am I doing? That's not right. I have obvious bugs in here. God, this stuff's so hard. Okay. That's that. So you gotta do that. How did this even, how did this not just break? Oh, fucking deep learning, man. I was just cutting one off the bat. go down at least now? No. Might be a different problem. I don't know, it might just be too low. How does anybody get this stuff to work? Does deep learning work or is it all a lie? Made up by a big support vector machine. Loss go down. Trust that samples works. Okay, um, how can we debug this? I, I mean, I can't believe we had that bug and it did anything. All right, so one way you can always make sure is if I set samples to zero times Bx, that should be the same sample over and over again and the loss better go to zero.
the loss isn't going to zero. It is just, ve wait, what? Okay, if it can't learn literally the same pattern over and over again, something is really messed up. time it did learn it, except it spiked. How is that happening? I'm feeding in the exact same thing every time. Right, it's the same thing every time. another bug. What are those twos getting set to? Maybe we can let it. Well, those are like masked actions. I mean, this is another good sanity check. So if the action predicted is a two, Same thing over and over again. Loss. Goes down, but very slowly. And then spikes up. Inexplicable. That's usually a problem. It's like lack of log softmax or something. But there's a log softmax right there. It's outputting twos. It's literally outputting twos. It should never output twos. Because that should strip all the twos from the beginning. And at the end, it should have a reward that's close to zero. Clip that, let's put that smaller. Much less force fine. Well no, it's just it's just learning on the same thing over and over again, but it's not learning. Okay, tensor training true, no grad false, zero grad optim step. Oh, okay, well now the loss got to zero, so that's great. Finally, it learned how to overfit my one sample. Okay, I mean, it looks like loss pretty reliably goes down now. The twos were causing it pain. I don't know why there's no bias there either.
Loss go down, very good. Okay, good. It's not predicting a lot of twos. I hate twos. How's the TC so high? Look at all the twos. Okay, we shouldn't have two count. We should say TC. Divided by length R. How is there so much percent of twos? There's a lot of percent of twos, but I'm never putting in twos. Why does it predict twos? The twos percent needs to go down. Does this make sense? Twos means you've lost the game. Twos also mean you just started the game. So that's very confusing. And let's increase this by two and make it three so you just start the game. And it can't predict threes. The loss go down. Sometimes you get good reward and sometimes you get bad reward. Do you not understand why? It doesn't understand why. Wow, if we think our world's confusing, imagine how this poor model feels. Good thing it doesn't have enough layers to be uh, sentient. I understand the model rights activists will eventually come for three layer models, but you know, until they do, So predicting a lot of twos. Like this is never gonna work. I'm asking for something way too complex. The loss is lower because it just predicts twos all the time. Huh. You know, we should really subtract the reward from the, the real reward. Like you have to compute reward to go as you go. Am I sure I'm implementing the reward to go correctly? Yeah, it's the same one I use in Beautiful Cart Paul. So probably. I can never be sure. Let's try a much larger batch size. Let's try 64. Rewards aren't discounted in Decision Transformer? Yeah, I think they should be.
There's probably some broadcasting bug. Like, why is this not learning way faster? And why is it still predicting twos? This doesn't make any sense. Okay, so these are the probabilities. My sampler is just totally busted. Just, just what did I just do? We'll go back to dividing by temperature, and we can go back to softmax. We just need to add an X. Now it's not twos anymore, that's good. But what happened? What did I write wrong? Okay, well, at least that's sane again. See, how does anyone ever make this stuff work? Okay, twos percentage quickly goes to zero, but that probability also craters to zero. So how do we fix that? Do we need a positional embedding? I mean, for carpool, we really shouldn't. I mean, but yeah, carpool should be so simple. I'm not that worried about that. Let's get rid of the reward to go. And let's add that back. And then let's say target return minus equals zero. That just collapsed even faster. Well, the loss is low.
No, but it's just like it just becomes so quick. Doing multiple actions for a run of the simulation? No. I'm gonna debug this. Discounts worked better. Not subtracting that. Because I mean, this should, in theory, like. Learns to end the game as fast as possible. Why? I mean, I agree that's definitely what it looks like. There's so much potential for bugs. Like the loss goes down, but the average episode length is also down. This is now doing worse than random ever since I fixed the sampler. Okay, uh, learning rate too high. Get rid of printing all those stupid actions. Maybe the actions are right. Doesn't predict many twos, which is good. We have a somewhat balanced policy there. But it should see that some of them are better than others. I get my hopes up every time it goes up. I shouldn't do that. Pretty large. I'm gonna go 384. You can also try not adding a positional embedding. I mean, it's cart pull, I don't need it, right? Just get rid of the positional embedding. Transformer learning can just be wrong. No, it's just it's just collapsed to total crap now.
you overfit on the policy, if you look at the to conquer the cart pole problem, no, I, I this has to work. In. All right, fine, all right. Can I do Lunar Lander? You think Lunar Lander is gonna work? We have so many bugs in this, you know? Um, what did I hard code for? I hard coded two here. And at least do your custom gym environment that tries to guess the previous state. Which one is that? Oh, that's smart. Yeah, you could have like a really dumb. That makes sense. Yeah, there should be environments that are just like good examples for reinforcement learning. Oh, when I made one. Yeah, I don't know. We can just sit here and pray for the numbers to go up. Should we try that? The power of the cross, the power of Christ. Please, Jesus, make the numbers go up. My machine learning is very bad, and I'd like it to be better. Mm. No, there's so many things can... Please, Jesus, make the numbers go up. Your crypto telegram, right? It's definitely learned something. It's learned how to just go there and never come back. But is that easy to do? Fly off screen? <laughs> it's not landing on the moon. <laughs> the only winning move. Uh, all right. Boys, we have so much to debug here. Uh, I think we should just do it. Let's debug with contrived data to see if our transformer is learning. And if our transformer is not learning, we can cry. All right, it's learned something new. It's learned something new. It's very repeatable, at least. Oh, oh, look at that. <laughs> I kind of think it's learning. It's trying this for a little bit. Yeah. 
Remember it's don't land on the moon phase? That was a good phase. Okay, so part of the problem now might be that we're clipping at 64. Uh, it looks like we're getting episodes that are way longer than that. So let's clip it one twenty eight. If this just magically starts to work. I mean, it's learning something, right? No, we, we should we should write some contrived. Okay, it's in its it's in its don't land on the moon phase now. Oh, I also have a bug. Highest reward should not be zero. Highest reward should be negative. Infinity. I was gonna actually try to put that in the first time. I don't know, negative a thousand. You can put in negative infinity. I don't know what that does. Might throw errors. Okay, it's learned about not landing on the moon. Our candidate would prefer not to be interviewed on stream. Uh, so we will not interview our candidate on stream. You just don't know what to expect. You don't want to tell you what to expect. I'm gonna ask you why my lunar lander doesn't land on the moon. <laughs> Better to not crash so it runs away. Is that actually true? doesn't want to get the negative one I don't know it's to say that it doesn't want to do anything implies that this thing works at all and I have some serious questions this is not predicting twos it did consistently stop predicting twos which is good oh <laughs> Whoa, whoa, that was close, boys. I think it's going to learn. No, nope, it's back to doing this. It's learning how not to do that. <laughs> We're just staring at nothing. RNG plays Pokemon. Okay. It's found a new thing. Just not firing the engines. Actually gets a pretty good reward for doing that. It has learned. OK, 
can't just use the engine sometimes. But look, the rewards are higher. Use the engine. I think it's stuck. I'm not giving it more reward for engine use. Come on, bring the engine back. No, it's very fixed in the I'm never firing the engine again phase. Remember, it's smoking weed Saturday, but we're, we're not trying that hard. You know, we should really be writing test cases and writing a few different test environments, seeing if it can learn in the test environments, or we can just run it again and see if it works better this time. What do you think? Now it's learned how to spam the right thruster. But all it's doing is spamming the right thruster. That can't possibly be good. You can't possibly ha be happy with yourself spamming the right thruster. That can't possibly be a fulfilling lifestyle. just jack the temperature up okay guys this isn't we, we've crossed over from machine learning to just randomly doing things does temp decay no and that's without decay it's already we still are suffering from collapse well, these new models love just spamming the right thruster is that the new like do you all have a little club where you're like talk about how hard you can press the right thruster <laughs> Oh, remember that one that learned? <laughs> Reinforcement learning doesn't work. <laughs> okay. All right, let's think of some contrived environments and let's, let's make it work in them. You landed, but you killed everybody on board. Da -na -na -na. Da, da, da. You landed, but you killed everybody on board. We haven't even st like like at least the lunar faller was getting pretty good scores. The lunar barrel roller just sucks. I don't understand. It should be pretty high. Um, okay, I don't know, small batch size. No, 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 we can get even more contrived in that environment, trust me. Oh, we got another lunar faller here. <laughs> it fell right in the middle, though.
Do things ever learn, or is that just too small of a learning rate? Let's try 3e minus 5. That sounds like a good learning rate. Sounds like a good number, right? 3e minus 5. All right, we're going to need coffee, and we're going to actually have to try to write environments. Why do we... Remind me to never try to do reinforcement learning on stream, because reinforcement learning just doesn't work. Okay, and if you thought it worked, someone lied to you, okay? I think this is just RNG lander. I don't actually think it's learning anything. My loss is not really going down. But at least it's using a diverse set of thrusters. Yeah, I know. 1E4 is Carpathy Blessed. I've heard about that one. I've heard that's a good learning rate. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think you've ever seen it land? I got one to work once. One of my, I think I did finally get this to work with PPO and like a massive amount of shit. Okay, guys, we're gonna, we're gonna see it land. Well, I think it's learned to be a lunar faller. Yes, it's learned to be a lunar faller. It's a common mode of collapse. Oh, the poor cruise. Okay, you know what? I like the one. Let's 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 make it shoot for the stars. Let's not update highest reward. And let's give it a highest reward. Uh, let's give it a target return of fifty. You can do it. Figure out what fifty might be. Interpolate, bro. Regret. Wait, no, we'll just change that to 50. We'll just change that to 50. Oh, we're not even trying anymore. We're not even trying anymore. Am I losing viewers? No, the viewers don't care. The viewers don't care if I try or not. No, we're going to try. What did I change? I don't even remember what I changed. I just changed something. Oh, I told it to shoot for the stars and try to get a 50. And it has no idea how to get a 50. So it just kind of tries random things. Look, it still has a twos percent. Like that's just really giving up. If you're predicting a two, you've just really given up. It's interesting. That definitely shows it's doing something though there. I look to see this twos percent. This might be too aggressive. 50 might be too far out of distribution. Let's try zero again. That was the bug that I wrote before, and I think that was actually the best run we had. Two's percent went away. This is when it learns to fly away. Are we in the wrong cat? Oh, are we in just chatting? Oh, we probably are in the wrong category. Oh, we should change categories. We'll do that now. Shouldn't it be decremented at each step? Yeah, it probably should. I don't know how to do that though. Did 
can try that. No, okay, let's let's try some very naive environments. They're not dead, they left the moon. They went that way, all right. We're gonna, we're gonna get some coffee and we're gonna try some simple environments. And if we can't learn the simple environments, then um, that's just sad. my song dedicated to all the lunar landers that have flown off into space <laughs> there were beautiful flags set up for them there's a great surface of the moon but they just decided to go up okay well I think this is we need the okay fine 3e minus 4 3e minus 4 that's that's the one that works I'm gonna get some coffee. We're gonna try some real environments. You will not beat me today, Lunar Lander. If we conquer Lunar Lander today, oh, if we manage to use a decision transformer to solve Lunar Lander, we'll be back on track for doing what we said we were gonna do on the streams. But you have to counterbalance that with the fact that reinforcement learning is impossible. Uh, so there's that. And considering this is reinforcement learning, it's impossible. So I don't know why we're even trying.
Did it learn? <laughs> we try not because it's easy, but because we thought it'd be easy. Okay. Uh, let's make a ridiculous environment. How do I actually write a real gym environment? I've been working on I've been working on a song. Uh, it's only dark the first time. We'll hang lights for those who come next. Oh, oh no, I have to do render? Oh, that's hard. This is impossible. I can't do that. Keep your hands inside. About reward scale. Now. You ready for this? We're gonna we're writing we're writing stupid crap, okay? What do I have to write? I gotta write reset and I gotta write step. And then for reset we return the observation. Uh I don't understand. We're writing like a contrived, stupid shit. Okay, uh, what? This times self dot size ret ret sub self dot. Um, now we have to make that self dot and we do. Step, uh, we return the, what's the observation? Um, it's always the same observation. All you have to do is learn how to guess the stupid. I'm giving you the thing, you just have to take the action. You have to literally press the button. One of the buttons lights up and you press the button, all right? Does everyone understand the game? One of these buttons is gonna light up and you are gonna you are gonna press the button, okay? Okay, does everyone, does everyone, just, just literally that, does my reward function, okay? All right, is everybody happy? Okay, is it terminated? Yeah, it's terminated, is it truncated? No, and that's not, all right. That's, we don't need those parentheses, those parentheses are dumb. Let's go, let's go, all right. Okay, we wrote stupid environment, okay? It's called button. Press the light up button, okay? We need use Java names here. Which button lights up? Okay, you literally just press the light up button, okay? Stupidest environment in the world. We can call it the press the light up button. When you wanna cite that in papers, you cite that in papers, okay? Press the light up button, has no shit. Okay, well, you know, that's because I didn't construct it. Okay, you gotta construct it. All right, boys, you gotta, you gotta construct it. Because if you don't construct it, you're gonna, what the, what, you, you fucking tuple? I'm gonna give you a tu tuple, 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 tuple. Yeah, well, that's because I put a comma there for no apparent reason. All right, let's get rid of that comma. Okay, well, why does it still make a lunar lander? You know, because they're right there, we're making a lunar lander. We don't wanna make lunar landers, why would we do that? Let me just comment those lines out, because we don't need any more lunar landers. We have, we have, all right, well, that can't be multiplied. That's too bad. Do 
Do I see one dollar? Is there one dollar? One dollar, one dollar, one dollar, one dollar, two dollars. Is there two dollars? Do I see two dollars? Three dollars. Three. ChatGPT, go write this shit. ChatGPT, go write this shit. Why am I writing this shit? Oh, what? That doesn't even make sense. The box. Oh, that's low and high. Okay, low and high is that. And the box is that. Okay, I just made the size of the box. Are you ready? The world is zeros or ones. Everything's a zero or a one. Okay? Can you learn? Uh, no, you can't learn. Congratulations. You're an idiot. All right, literally, there's two buttons. You either press that button or that button. Don't press the two button. Right. Can it learn how to play this game? It cannot learn how to play this game. This is the stupidest transformer I've ever seen. Okay, if you can't learn... Okay, if you can't learn how to play, press the light up button. Okay, it can't even learn how to play, press the light up button, okay? Let's see if we can play press the light up button, okay? Can we pray press the light up button? Let's pray press the light up button. Okay, so we're gonna get the observation, okay? Mm. Print the observation, we're gonna get an input. And this input's gonna be called the action, okay? We're gonna get an action, you ready for an action? Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna end dot step act, and we're gonna print that, okay, ready? You guys ready to play? Press the light up button, okay? Press the light up button, let's play, okay? Did we mess this game up? Okay. Which button lit up? Is it button zero or button one? Let's play button zero. Well, look, we got a reward. Button zero. Yay. Zero. Oh, okay. Well, this one, we're going to guess one and we're going to get it right. Okay. This one, we're going to get zero. Look, we got it wrong. Press the light up button. Come down all day. It's the easiest fucking game in the world. If you can't play, press the light up button. You are a certified moron. All right, press the light up button. Does everyone see how to play press the light up button? Does everyone understand the rules? Do you understand the rules? Okay, well, I can't even play this, so that sucks. Wait, this model is so stupid, it can't play press the light up button. You got 50% of them. You guessed one all the time. Stop it. <sighs> all right. Let's look at some episodes of press the light up button, okay? We don't need 128. Let's just clamp it to four. Four sounds good. You learning how to play press the light up button? Wait, what? How did that do that? Don't even understand what just happened. Why is it doing so many things? I'm getting rid of that. I'm getting rid of that. This is the easiest game in history. And it can't play it. You literally press the light up button, okay? All right, everybody come down, play press the light up button, okay? Let's take a look at the rewards, the states, and the actions from press the light up button. Oh, the reward is actually always zero. No, wait, that one had reward. Okay, this one has some reward. Uh, what? I don't even understand this. It's like not right. Oh, okay. Well, we still have decay. I don't know if we need decay. Let's just get rid of decay. That just made things more complicated. I don't even think it matters, but whatever. It's just one more thing that can't be wrong, okay? Could my Mew Zero learn to play press the light up button? That's the same bug I wrote before. The exact same bug I wrote before. Okay. See, sometimes it wins if press the light up button. All right, so there's the button. It pressed one, which was the right choice, since that was the lit up button. And that one pressed one too, but that one pressed zero and button one was lit up. 
Down to zero, and button one was lit up, so it got a reward. Now I press one, and button one was light up. Okay, great. So I'll press the light up button seems to work. No, no, you press the light up button, okay? This is why we have subscriber only. It, it, Origin Dota, you know, honestly, how many of you would fail I press the light up button? Like, let's be real here. Let's be real about who couldn't play this game. What about an Epsilon Greedy strategy? Uh, okay, I mean, we can even try. We'll set the sampler to, to just do that. No temperature. And it still can't learn to play Press the Light Up button. We've turned, oh. You literally just, just press the one that lights up, bro. Okay, well, it can't learn press the light up button, but oh. Oh, that's because my target return is zero. But then it should be trying to lose, actually. So I don't even know what to say about that. You were literally trying to lose, and you couldn't even lose at press the light up button. You're that dumb. Something's just broken. Wait. Boys. That was a good streak of press the light up button. Is it learning? <laughs> Oh, I got a lucky streak. <laughs> the loss is definitely zero. Let's print the action distribution. Decision transformer is too complicated. Let's make stupider decision transformer, okay? Let's make stupid decision transformer. We were so far away from anything actually working. You couldn't even play press the light up button. Okay, stupid decision transformer. Hey, decision transformer, I want to tell you if stupid decision transformer solves this problem and you can't. Um, oh, we have a JIT. That's fine.
Huh? Let's just seek one. Just not put minus one there. So it doesn't even do any transformer junk. Uh, this one can't learn either. Okay, does machine learning work? R real question. Wait, does TinyGrad not work? What if TinyGrad's broken? Did I break TinyGrad? I did make a lot of changes. Possible I broke something. Let's see if GBT2 still works. Just a different problem. Wait, can I just seriously break Tiny God? Maybe, or maybe those tests are just dumb. GPT-2 still works. It's beautiful item that still works. Beautiful item that still works. Wait, that's less beautiful than usual though. Wait, I think I might have broken Tiny Red. That's stupid. This whole time I just broke Tiny Grad. Because of that because of that contraction thing. That was wrong. This is making me mad. Oh, deep learning sucks, bros. Okay, if I do beautiful I missed on master, what out accuracy do I get? Oh yeah, look. See that one works. And the, the worst part is, it like kind of works if you do it wrong, but it doesn't completely work. 
this should get like 90 this should get like 90 uh, 98 but I broke something and it doesn't get 98 on the LL transformer branch it's just worse there's some bug this doesn't work But that was completely my fault for... Okay. Well, I'll notice that even with that bug fixed, it's still... Deep learning's impossible! I know, I know. Look, I know all these things. All right, we're doing better now. We're doing better. Wait, I, I don't like. I don't like how I subtly broke something by doing that. Tiny guy needs so many more tests. I, I will note, by the way, that master still works fine. It was my fix from before that broke things. That's what we get for smoking weed. You know, that's what we get. That was before we smoked weed. Okay, this should be the easiest thing in the world to learn. I'm literally just asking you to learn. I put things in the right order, right? It's literally gonna be this stupid. Like I like did stuff in the wrong order. Target return. I set the batch size to 16. That's crazy high. We now have the simplest possible problem. The action, the state, and the reward. Why is the reward always zero? It's not even what we're learning on. Let's print what we're learning on. Is this never called with training? Right there, tensor drop training equals true. Then we, oh, we call model dot forward. Okay, that's fine. Wait, wait, that's not really right. Oh no, that is right. We thought this was all gonna work in like the complex JIT and stuff. Wow, we were we were so off the mark. We were so we were so done in Kruger on this, you know. Okay. I'll 
I'll press the light up button. We're gonna, we're gonna at least, if we can't solve press the light up button, we're gonna have to give back our machine learning card. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna take it away from us. Uh, oh, do I have to put an access into softmax? No, this one's probably right. Once it works, will it scale to solve AGI? Yeah, probably. I mean, that's the kind of cool thing, right? Like when you get, after you get press the light up button to work, there's, there's very little between press the light up button and AGI. Output the action. Okay. The data looks fine. Why is the learning not happening? Coming out the forward jet. I don't think it's my embedding. That doesn't even matter, because that's always fixed for the one that I actually managed to use. All right, let's get stupider. Oh, well, I guess, what if we just try, press the light up button is actually a very complicated game. We have an even stupider version where the button that lights up is just always the first button. Can it learn this? It can't even learn that, that. Oh, guys, I think it finally learned to play a game. It finally learned how to play a game. Okay, it's press the light up button, but the button that lights up is always the first button. It took a long time to learn how to play that game. Like it takes many episodes. Up oh, that time it didn't get it. Something's really broken. It, that time it failed at literally play press the light up button where the button that lights up is always button zero. Reinforcement learning is impossible. And also, how did I break TinyGrad in such a way that it's just subtly wrong? What did I do wrong here? have to check to see if the strides are actually contiguous. Uh, okay, well, I see what I did wrong there. No, we're not even using trans, we haven't even gotten to transformers yet. We're just, we're just. That embedding seems to work. How about the state?
That embedding seems to work. How about the reward? And that embedding works. Okay, good. All the embeddings work. Let's look at the embeddings together. Do they work together? That one's different, but that's always the first action embedding. Okay. I mean, should be fine. Where did I hard code 12? Oh, right there. Okay, that's the action. That's the state. So we have action and state, and then we have reward. We shouldn't even train on that last one, actually. I can I can even truncate this. I can even. Even clip art one. I have two buttons. It's, it's the dumbest thing I could possibly make. Wait, why does that affect that? Why is the loss on that? Oh, because you have to take the action for the next one. Okay, that's right. Should be normal numbers, right? Those aren't numbers. No, those should be numbers. What? Those are the actions. Those are the states. Those are the actions. Oh, and I guess we need the rewards too. Okay, so these are the states, these are the actions. So we got one. Okay, 
so here, when the button was one, it pressed one, it got a reward of one. Button was one, pressed one, got a reward of one. Here when the button was one, press zero, got a reward of zero. Okay, great. The optimal strategy is to literally press the light up button. It's the dumbest strategy in the world. This is the dumbest game in the world. Yet this thing for some reason can't beat it. Okay. Sometimes you just have to press the light up button and we're gonna write the dumbest code. Okay, the code's about to get dumber. We're gonna start from dumb and we're gonna go to smart, okay? Okay, so this is the game. It's called press the light up button. I'm going to bring in the stupid decision transformer. So by the way, we were just staring at RNG all the time before. sequence length. Okay. No, okay, we, we don't have to we don't have to go this far. I'm getting rid of this. We're just gonna we're gonna be very careful, slow and methodical. I know those things aren't my strong suit. Okay, we gathered data. Let's test them all. So, for a reward, The action we're going to start with is action three. The observed state is one comma zero, and our target return is one. Do this, you never forget. You never forget how this thing works. We test the model. For some reason, we're putting some other logits there, which doesn't really make sense. Um, oh, it's probably our pure softmax and stuff. Okay, regardless. Long soft max action on pi. Okay. 
Okay, so I'm gonna run the model. Bring the token better. We don't need that. Okay, so this is our desired reward. This is our desired reward here. When this is this, when this is pressed, we don't press that. But why does this not work? Why does it ever learn that this is an okay action? It never sees that action. It's just, it's almost like it just isn't learning. isn't learning. Optim zero grad, loss backwards, optim step. Doing that right, right? I'm putting the parameters in the model. I think it's just so broken. Remember when we just stared at the lunar lander and thought it might land? Oh, the old days. It's like the loss is really high. So this is the same as that. Let's make contrived train. So hang on, we, we can actually just do this with batch sizes. Um, target return. One, one, uh, well, that's somehow time step, which we don't really care about. It doesn't matter, it's equivalent. If I if I uh, sparse categorical cross entropy it to uh... we're running out of places for bugs to hide.
but I don't think it's better in PyTorch. Like I've struggled with stupider things in PyTorch. Uh, okay, a dot logit sparse categorical cross entropy. One one three. Okay. So desired act. Make that a tensor. Desired action there is that, desired action there is that. My embedding's broken. Let's get rid of just one of these. This is completely independent of time. If it can't learn this, how's it going to learn anything? You can like look at the gradients and stuff. Just hasn't trained long enough. No, it gets no smarter. It doesn't even learn that twos are bad actions. I guess it does, but like very slowly. I bet there's some like bug with okay, this is like the token embedding every time and like it does move a little bit wait why are those 
the same. Why are those the same? They start out the same? Pretty close to the same. Sure, aren't all pretty close to the same. Hmm. That's sort of annoying. What did I initialize embedding with? Core uniform, that's fine. What do I initialize linear with? Gaming uniform, that's fine. Oh, okay, so each one of those is one embedding. So that's the action embedding. Those actually all are the same. This is the reward embedding. Which again, it makes sense. This is that, and this is the uh, state embedding. And then it's being told to predict either this or that. Assuming this actually works, which I'm starting to think that's where the bug is. I don't know if this thing was designed to work uh, for more than What if I do this? And then here I do dot reshape minus one and three. It learns just very, very slowly. Okay, I don't know, let's give it a larger learning rate. like it learned. Why are these learning rates just so small? So at least it's learning not to press that one. What does that mean? totally right. Take the log soft max, multiply it by that, take the sum. I don't think there's anything in loss mask. True. Divides it by one, that does nothing. Take the derivative of that. Here, grad backwards step. It's learning how to diminish the difference between those. It's just learning how to like mish all the loss together. I feel like there's some like broadcast issue, but I'm not sure where it would be. I'm, 
I'm just like I'm I'm lost for I should expect this to work. What did I forget? Why is this loss not going to zero? Does that loss go to zero? That loss goes to zero. But it can't distinguish them for some reason. Even though they look pretty different to me. On topic, please. Okay. Target return for the batch. Time step zero, time step one, time step two, time step three. Target return is like the desired uh, reward. We can call it reward if you want. Desired action, okay. State, let's go through the states. Okay, so the state for batch size one, time step one is this. Isn't there a desired reward infinity? What are you talking about? Okay. So we'll go through all the states now. If your target return is one, that you do that, you do that. If your target return is zero, you do that. If it's that, you do that. Okay, good. Let's turn these into tensors. Like, I'm going to get this, and then what's it going to be? Oh, we don't do uh, fake act goes here. Then my loss is literally just this sparse categorical cross entropy desired act. Am I trying to teach a linear model XOR? <laughs> Maybe. We'll give it. You want me to give it another layer? Well, now the losses are more of a mesh, but. You're right, because it, it was converging to something that looked like what happens when you try to teach a linear model XOR. Let's give it another layer. Mm. 
You agree this should definitely be able to learn it, right? Same crap. Same blah. Though to be fair, no, that's not XOR. I'm trying to teach it. I'll give it a dim of 12, too. No, that doesn't matter. The same blah effect. Okay, the target returns are wrong. I mean, okay, that seems to learn the function. Let's not, let's just test the model here. No norms or anything. I think no reason that should work. All right, let's get stupider. I agree. I don't know if it's tiny grad weirdness or Oh, I have to name it properly. Even stupider decision transformer. Is 
the action embedding that literally does nothing. This, do, this does not matter. Okay. What's the function I'm trying to learn? It's like it's like some linear looking shit. No, we also need another reward. We can't just know the state. One, two, three, four. Okay, it's four. The output action space is not plus one. Didn't learn. try just the state next. Okay, we will try just the state. No, we need we need the state and the reward. Doesn't work with only the state. We don't need the action. That should learn, right? Definitely learns there's a 50-50 probability there. Probably like bugs in tiny graph. Now I'm thinking that's what it has to be. Because, like, this doesn't make sense. Okay, it can't distinguish those. If it's not XOR that it's trying to learn, is it? This needs to be zero. This needs to be one. This needs to be one. And this needs to be zero. Well, it's like a linear function. Okay. Let's get even dumber. Okay, we have one comma one comma zero. And for the output, you should predict zero. You have one comma zero comma one. And for the output, you should predict one. You have zero comma one comma zero. For the output, you should predict one. And then you have zero comma, and let me just put a float in each one of them. 
0 comma 0 comma 1 and you should output 0 okay great um, model sub x Is three, the action space is two. This object has no attribute linear. Oh, so we gotta make those tensors. Great. Okay, let's go even stupider than this. I want you to learn to predict this. XOR and linear layer can't learn now if that's XOR. Well, it can't learn that. Well, fine. So we need a nonlinear layer. How many layers do I need? Two? Two a good number of layers? <sighs> Deep learning just doesn't work. I give up on deep learning. Okay, is ReLU a good enough nonlinearity? Okay, now it learns. With very varying degrees. Of, no, sometimes it doesn't learn. Sometimes it doesn't learn. That time. Dude, uh, deep learning's fucked. Okay, there we go. Now we got something that should always learn. Fucking lottery ticket hypothesis bullshit. Dude. I, I feel I feel so scammed. Like, deep learning's a scam. Okay. All right. Let's work our way, let's work our way back up the stupids. Let's work our way back up the stupids, okay? All right. That one was really stupid. Let's look at this one. It didn't learn. Okay. Let's give it a little more space. Print a comment that it works. Whatever. Okay. Now this one doesn't work. Why doesn't it work?
stupidest test works. Instead of doing this, let's change this to 0 and 1. XOR is a hard function, to be fair. It's very, I understand why it's very difficult. Sparse categorical cross entropy to Y. Nope, and now it doesn't learn again. I don't understand why it's XOR either, but that one learns. So stupidest test two doesn't work. There's something wrong with sparse categorical cross entropy. Oh, is it because they're not floats? Oh, maybe. No, no actually they shouldn't be floats, right? No, it's because those are actually the wrong shape, though. It should actually just be this. Okay, of course, with no error, and it seems to learn slightly slower, but it still learns. Okay. Let's make stupider a test. We're slowly working our way up the deep learning. State space is unused. For some reason it's four. Oh. Was I trying to use even stupider decision transformer for something? I don't think I tried to use that one. Let's just use stupid decision transformer. has got low there that's pretty good all right it seems like that works now for some I don't know how Press the light up button, okay? Uh, all right, active space should not be three, it should be two, but maybe that's what's causing the problem. No, that works fine. Huh. Okay. Maybe it was just the XOR thing the whole time. All right, let's.
let's pray. Press the light up button. Does this work? No. Put it all together. It doesn't work yet. But we're getting we're getting closer, guys. We're making progress. Okay. Stupidest test seems to work. Um. We cannot do that. Okay, and then we can put desired output. Okay, it's gonna work. Okay, look, well, they they are equal now. Okay. We got something to learn. I, I don't know why the other one doesn't learn, but stupider tests passes. All right. Great. Okay, so that's two, two. Let's output, let's print this here and see if that matches. Two, okay. Don't need that. That's junk. Guys, we're almost there, okay? If stupider test works, and like we comment that it works, okay? Guys, you don't understand how actually close we are to AGI, okay? As soon as we can play press the light up button, that's AGI. Like, 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 if, because it learned to do that. You know, it's, it's astonishingly hard to, like, learn tic-tac-toe. Um, we have this one working. So now let's see, what about this? Somehow doesn't match. This. Wait, I think it is like learned how to play the game. After many struggles, it sometimes learns how to play the game. It learned once how to play the game. Now it just learned how to output zero. Oh yeah, we got reward. Zero, we got reward. Yo, yo, this game's fire, boys. We're pressing the light up button. One. Oh, I didn't get reward. I played wrong. Yeah, stupider test learns. Okay, this learned like once. But I don't know 
point doesn't reliably learn. It should be pretty much the same thing. Though I guess there could be sampling noise here. See, look, just learning to always play zero. No, learns to always play one. No, you're too aggressive with the learning rate. Let's lower the learning rate. What happens if I lower the learning rate in the speaker test? Does it learn? Still learns, okay. Doesn't learn as decisive of a policy, but it definitely learns. Okay, that's fine. Okay, now it's not learning anymore. It's the same stuff. I have a state. Eight two one, eight two two. Eight two. Eight two one. Eight two one. Oh. I mean, okay, to be fair, I'm putting two of them in somehow. No, but I'm not. No, no, that's just that. I guess I run the forward on two of them. That shouldn't matter because I, regardless, let's not do that. I'm doing extra compute anyway. Uh, so let's just put that, 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 that. We'll cut the last time step off because we only have those actions. And then we can just do a logit sparse categorical cross entropy. Changes nothing. How is this different from stupider test? Which may I remind you works. doesn't matter because I have the same test model code here. No, actually I don't. Let's get the test model code. No, see, it doesn't work. It kind of works. Anyone who ever told you they were doing deep learning is lying. 
I think that the company has just figured out that you just get people to type in all the weights. And then they tell them it's deep learning so that everyone else is just a red herring. It's not like it's just a psyop. There's no deep learning. I think this works. Are we having any progress? No. By the deep state, right? Sounds right. No, like learn, you piece of shit. If I if you ate dinner, I wouldn't give you any tonight. Oh look, that one's increasing. Oh, it's going down again. Oh, that one learned to predict one. Oh, this one's learning to predict one too. Oh, is it gonna work? Oh look, it learned. It just took forever. The reward is now one all the time. It's just the slowest like, thing you can imagine. Oh, see, that one learned to be one. Now soon that one's going to learn to be one. There we go. I mean, it, it learns. It just takes 32 years. Okay, let's put the big decision transformer in and see if that works. Maybe it's faster. No, if I jack the learner it up, it collapses. Okay, now we have this bug again. Great. Well, we at least know how to fix that. Still works. We didn't break it. Uh, so the strides. Okay. We have to check if those strides are contiguous or not.
that's contiguous. See the problem? Oh. This is this is just frustration. This is this is not good programming. You can't actually do that. What? Just try they're both zero. Wait, that's actually fine. That one's not fine. Oh, I'm not even returning ret. that I just return it on there. Is that fine? I didn't need that at all. Oh, I needed some of that. Maybe that's when I went off the rails and got stupid. Supported type for oh well, that's a different problem, I think. I think I put none in there somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have none in the test, so that's fine. Okay, well, now this one doesn't learn. And not only does it not learn, it doesn't learn very slowly. Quickly convert to all ones. Let's see if I broke anything. That seems fine. just outputs, just snaps to one output. This one learns just excruciatingly slowly. 
It would have been faster if I gave it more layers. I actually might. the same shitty speed. In fact, it still hasn't learned. Because it must never see that example. Okay, now it's learned. Reinforcement learning doesn't work. Okay? Someone might have told you that reinforcement learning does work, but they're a dirty liar, okay? Because it doesn't work. Now this is again collapsing immediately to a ridiculous state. The model test should still be right, right? Well, what is the... Let me test the model before I even train. Okay, don't update. That's just strange. Some of them output two, it learns not to output two, and then eventually it learns to output some ones. Bias is towards zeros, but eventually that one flips. This one, oh, and now this one's gonna flip. There, there's one, and it converges. Okay, that pretty reliably converges, and it looks like it stays converged now. Why can our decision transformer not learn? As soon as we switch to this thing, it doesn't learn anymore. Okay, first let's get rid of the JIT. We don't need a JIT right now. JIT's just one more thing that can break. the JIT was with breaking things. But look, it's like good and then it updates. The first step just destroys it completely. Like is the learn rate too high? Maybe. But again, it's, it's converged to junk. Converges immediately to that. Okay, we, I mean, we can do rollouts like while length of all are less than BS. So we get some diversity. learned. Look at that. Very fast, too. See, look what I'm looking for. So, see, the, these are zeros. This is one zero. Uh, I wish I had a NumPy. How do I 
not do scientific notation. What are we suppressing? Okay. It becomes very confident in its outputs. And it shouldn't be. Like this one didn't totally converge. That that's wrong there. And again, we're back to very quick snap judgments that are wrong. It's entirely based on what we get as an initial. Uh, just, do we get lucky? You feeling lucky, punk? It's learning something now. We're making some progress. There we go. See, it's right now. Okay, cool. Right, it didn't work with the JIT. Um, we have no idea if it works with temporal things, but at least it's winning most of the time at pressing the light up button. Uh, where's my rollout where I print the, where's that print? Let's stop testing the model. Oh, it's not doing any more rollouts, I see. Uh, I'm gonna put this back. one every time, but somehow it's wrong about that. Oh, no, that time it got the other one. Okay, that time it got it. It's very sensitive to the initial conditions. Should we try going deeper? Let's go deeper. I'm literally having GPT-2 play, play press the light up button and it loses at it. My initialization may just be crappy too. Like I kind of suspect that's why TinyGrad didn't train the, uh, the ResNet to the required accuracy. It's like, yeah, my initializer of this, I'm doing, I'm doing Cayman uniform, but like, who knows? Who knows if that's right? Um, inside transformer block, who knows? Feed forward, linear, so those right? I don't know. Where do I get the hidden dim for that? Four times dim, well, that's ballsy. I don't know, let's go with small. Is that one gonna flip? Okay, that one flips. This one's still learning too. It's only 90% confident. You see the confidence here? Okay, then that one flips. There we go. Okay, I mean, it's learning to play press the light up button. That's all I can say. There weren't any bugs. It was just lots of hyperparameters and also reinforcement learning doesn't work. Okay, now way to like just do Jim make AGI and it's gonna do AGI. Uh, okay, well, we can't test the model anymore. I'm gonna commit that because I know it works. Sometimes, if we get a good seed.
Can I increase the temperature? The temperature is already very high. You, you can look at what the probabilities are converging to, and I don't think that's going to help you. Cart pull. Press the light up button is a really hard game. Okay, well that one just converged to pressing one all the time. Oh, am I not? What's my target return? I think my target return is zero. And my target return is one, so that's not going to work. Uh, we can go back to highest reward. That's mostly pretty good. It's not like it's not that my temperature is high, though. I'm telling you. Uh, 0.7, we can go higher. I'm telling you to shit it, they initialize this shit with, with, uh, with deep Q. Oh, where'd my line go for my training here? Not shape, that's stupid. Bring the plot back. Should I use two figures? Let's use two figures. GPT, write this shit for me. To give it a while. I also disabled the JIT, unfortunately, so it's a lot slower doing the rollouts. We can try to re-enable the JIT and see what I broke there. I have an idea that I might not have broken anything, and it might just be the uh, that I, it was just a test. Okay, the loss is not really going down, but that's okay. Give it time. All things take time. I like that it's maintaining diversity at least. What did I make the batch size? Eight. I think I'm probably gonna get bigger. Whoa. We love diversity. I don't know about equity and inclusion. I don't know if those things help RL. No, really, we need merit. We need you to take their best action. You know what the action is, the best action. You gotta take the best action. One time it got 93, that was that was a good time. That was a long time ago though. 
I don't know. Like, is it learning? Maybe it's learning. Probably not. I actually doubt it's doing anything. At least it has not collapsed. It's still outputting twos sometimes. This thing is unforgivably stupid. Oh no. No, the, the, you don't understand. There's no policy. Like, it, it's... You just put the reward in and you tell it to do things. Oh, okay. So I guess one thing I did was I got rid of... So that's equal there. So, okay, let's, let's try that. I don't know if that's going to change anything, but... Um, we should also be able to learn better if I increase the batch size. So let's put the batch size up to 32. It didn't have to be. Can you give an explanation of this transformer? Read the paper. Of course, the paper makes it look so easy until you actually try to, you know, make it deep learn. And then you remember that deep learning, especially reinforcement learning, doesn't work. Um, oh, look at that loss going down. Oh, yeah. Yeah, go down. Yeah, that's the direction you want your loss to go. Oh. Okay, the loss looks like it's still going down. It may not understand the monotonicity of reward. How do they choose their highest reward? How do they choose their, uh... oh, I guess, well, this problem kind of sucks. Target return. Yeah. So the loss is going up. Let's just, it's nice that we can always go back to press the light up button. It's a great, it's a great task for everyone who believes in tasks. It should eventually, it should pretty quickly get to, yeah. Okay, look, it actually gets good at press the light up button. Okay, so we, we, we've made some progress. Notice how that's getting one reward every time. It's clamped to the highest reward. That's pretty good. Um, you want to also see if it can lose every time, just for fun. You can also set, like, we can just set target return to zero, and we'll see if it learns to lose every time. I press the light up button. So give it a little bit. Lose. Oh, well, here we go. Now it learns to lose. Okay, so it takes about it takes about fifty episodes to press the light up button, and it can reliably play that game. I feel so good. We we did reinforcement learning and it learned something. So I'm 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 just I'm I'm hopeful for everything else now. Um I don't know if we should try to re-enable the jet. 
Does it reliably learn to play press the light up button? If, if we could get something that could reliably learn to play cart pole, that would be a great victory for reinforcement learning. And then you're right. I've never seen that lunar lander actually land nicely. I think I saw it once on YouTube, but they had a guy with a they had a guy with a uh, Xbox controller. We're still streaming, Alex. Wow. We've learned how to play press the light up button. Do you know how to play press the light up button? This one's for you. What is it? Uh, court summons? No, it's your ID. Oh, it's my ID. Whoa, that's cool. Oh, voters, we're not doing that this year, guys. Every time I vote, I'm upset, and every time I don't vote, I'm upset. And that's why, just, you know how to play press the light up button? No, what is it? Okay, so you have two buttons, okay. and one of them lights up. And you press the one that lights up. Okay. And that's the whole game. Because it sounds very straightforward. Well, I know, but trust me, not all models are smart enough to learn it. But don't worry, we now have a model that after playing the game just 50 times <laughs> can learn how to play, press the light up button. Oh, no, no, <laughs> um, ID reveal, you did gift subs. I would think about it, but okay. Let's play Lunar Lander. <laughs> All right, we got Lunar Faller. Well, it's, it's gonna have to do a bunch anyway before it. Before it goes, uh, I need more coffee. And I had something else to do, but I forget what it was. Are you gonna make coffee? No, I'm gonna have cold brew coffee. Why are you making coffee? No, I, just, I, I like Barton's. Just... say the loss is very much going down wait boys it might be working no we're staring at a random thing again remember when we stared at a random thing last time we never really found the bug we just fixed it What happened to not wearing all black? I gave up on that. Now I'm back at work and all I care about is work. The loss is still going down. So I actually have big hopes for this model. Even though the... Oh, is position embedding enabled? I don't know. Uh, yes, it is. We definitely had a bug before, the one that was breaking uh, Beautiful Amnest. It's all putting twos with some percent of the time. Whoa. I think it's learning. Okay, you wanna go let it do 10 on its own? It can't learn cart pole, but someone said this thing could never learn cart pole and that you had to initialize cart pole with good policy data. I think it is getting better, I agree. I mean, the rewards aren't better, but That was worse. It's like trying things though, which is cool. A big spike and a loss there. We should probably have something that discards the older samples. 
It'll also be a lot faster if I disable the display. Try a positive target reward? Well, it has a positive target reward now. Because it did manage to hit that once. I don't know how. Okay, but look, the loss spiked. But that could be okay, right? It could just be now it's exploring like a different part of the space, which is actually pretty cool. I think this is gonna learn. I just don't think it's fast. Right, should, we, uh, should we implement saving of the model? I don't like we're not saving the optimizer state. Tony Grad's not good about that stuff. Okay, I think it got dumb again. It still has all the good ones in the replay buffer, so. You know, but look, the model got dumb. That's the loss there. Like it was going down and now it's gotten stupid. So, no, I don't think it's learning rate scheduling. I think that the I mean, the, the distribution of the data definitely changed, right? And this may actually reconverge. I, I can't say it's gone forever. But part of the problem may be that this highest reward thing is, it really has no idea that the rewards are like monotonic. And I wonder if the paper does anything about that. No, see, they just have... The separate tokens aren't going to help. I mean, we haven't done that many rollouts. Like these things, whenever I've done Lunar Lander before, I've never gotten it less than 500. Loss is coming down again. So is the reward. <laughs> like it's possible that it just does well on one and then just gets itself into a bad state and then has no idea what to do. Okay, I think that we should add back in I, do I have reward? Oh, I do have reward subtraction again. Is there a way I can change the render mode? What's the default render mode? Complicated bullshit code. How slow is it if I'm not doing render mode human? That's all still the first. Pretty useless. Oh, wait, what are we doing? 
Well, I still have a two there. Well, that doesn't work. That might be why cart pull didn't work, actually. Um, okay. Let's go back to playing press the light up button, because we know press the light up button is reliable and a good game. And then let's increase that two to things that are not two. Okay, I learned how to play this. Um, let's raise this up to 128. Should still learn, just slower. Maybe not much slower. No. It doesn't learn with all that garbage padded on the end. We might want to mask it. Okay, what does it break at? What if I do four? Problem might just be that there's like no signal in the thing anymore. Or is it explicitly broken? Interesting. Okay. It might just be explicitly broken with more than uh, with more than two. And that uh, that's fair actually. Uh, this might just have to do with how I'm doing sparse uh, categorical cross entropy. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, again, I don't know how Lunar Lander did anything. Because this is totally wrong. This has to actually be this. Think. No, that's fixed elsewhere. Okay. So just with three, it breaks. We have a test for sparse categorical cross entropy with more things. There should be a positional embedding too, so this shouldn't actually break. This is where it came from, along with code that learns Lunar Lander. Upside down reinforcement learning. I'm pretty sure awards. No, no. Whatever. Okay, good. Let's just fix this for, for this. Um, so the problem is in clip R. Oh, I shouldn't put two there, first of all. That's a mistake. That happens to be correct. Or I should probably actually do minus one there. Which at least won't have any loss.
if my sparse categorical works. Okay, that works. I should never learn to predict two. Uh, some reason that has action space plus one. I don't really know why. It's just a fake action. It's fine. Okay. But yeah, this is fine. I'm not actually masking the transformer. But that worked before. Okay, that works. Uh, let's put it up to 128 and see if it still works. We're just masking the return. We're masking the uh, cross entropy return at the end of the episode, which is fine. Let's see if it works at 128. Okay, good. It takes a tiny bit longer. I don't know. The transformer's masked. Great. All right, card ball. Mostly collapsed. Narrow work, get out of here. I've told you about the volcano, man. I've told you. you just, just like, what kind of person would I be if I took you seriously? What kind of person am I that I get upset? Why doesn't my reinforcement learning work? That's what you really have to focus on. These are the real problems in the world. Am I okay? Yeah. There's just there's just idiots on the internet, you know? And it's upsetting. Because I wish everyone on the internet was smart. And they used to be. Until the eternal September. And then the noobs just kept coming. You know that you know that porno about the girls never came? You know the girls never came and it was just dudes? It's like that, but the internet, and it's the idiots, and they do come, and it sucks. Hey, like, I feel like it wants to learn. Even subscribers only is lost. Yeah, I know. I mean, it's just, it's just the hordes of the, it's, it's like, it's the same things happening in the real world. Like, you know, like, 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 there's no more separation between the first and third world. The internet's just, it's the internet's just the third world. I feel, like, I feel like it wants to learn every time it does that. You know, like, you can learn, man. Learning is possible. You can be smarter. Be smarter. Uh, my positional embedding could be messing things up. We can turn it off. So card pole may just not work. I like seeing my lunar landers. What was it learning before? Or just whatever, we were just getting lucky before. You need better than random inputs, okay. I mean, so we did have great, like there was great gains in, there was great results in the loss with Lunar Lander. Okay, this is really slow. Should we try to turn the JIP back on?
That guy said it took 300 epochs. How do they define an epoch? Good result after 700 epochs. Oh, that's cool. Desired return and actual return. Oh, we can plot that too. I'm gonna plot our desired return on the same graph as the first one. That's pretty cool. Is that a list? That's a list. Oh, Maybe that. Did we can get the jit turn back on? Let's get the jit turn back on. I hate when things are slow. Press the light up button. Uh, what do I do? What did I break? Oh. Get negative a thousand. Oh, that's desired. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, that learned even faster than usual. That's great. Um, can it learn with the JIT on? So we have to add back the JIT reset. In rollout model dot forward jet reset forward jet forward jet no it doesn't learn with the jet oh maybe it does oh we're good just took a while okay fine the jet just works. Good. We've had very few tiny grad bugs except for that one from before. Uh, most of these bugs are just kind of like hyper parameter reinforcement learning some possible kind of bugs. All right, Lunar Lander, that, that, let's go. All right. And they keep learning, learning, learning. We're raising the ceiling. Oh, 
This is this is one step away from AGI. Don't 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 you feel it? If we, if we just like like turn this on the world instead of lunar lander, I couldn't land this lunar lander. Well, you know, it's just 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 it's the same algorithm as AGI. You just need to scale it up a little bit. They got 700 epochs, but I felt like they were getting gradually better over time. Whereas we, on the other hand, are not. You know how to do better, do better. Remember that time we thought it was learning, but like maybe it wasn't? His orange line kept going up. My orange line does not. Okay, all right, all right, fine, fine, fine. We're in the period of great struggle. Wow, let's watch a GIF of it working. Wow, that's a nice GIF. Is the cutoff still two? No, I fixed the, the cutoff. No, I, I changed the clip to 128. I think that's fine. Yeah, most none of these episodes are going to 128. All you do is learn by trial and error, okay? I'm saying that's not how AGI works. It's totally how AGI works. I feel like the loss got lower last time. I don't know. Maybe we should try a higher learning rate. Learning rate is low. Like these problems are low dimensional too, which sucks. Let's also change this to every 25 to watch an epoch. It is fast now too, which is nice. Not sarcastic. This is AGI voice. This is it. It's just gonna, it's just gonna foom from here. Okay, look, the loss is lower than last time, now that I raised the learning rate. Oh, it's learned to be lunar faller. Oh, oh good, I forgot how to be lunar faller, that's good. Come on, learn. All right, Lunar Faller. A lot of episodes have fallen. But it fell right in the middle that time. It's hard to overcome being Lunar Faller. You can get a pretty good reward by falling. You just gotta fall in the right place. This is definitely not what's in your brain, okay? Something in your brain's gotta work way better than this. With SpaceX landing produced by AI? Have you seen AI try to do this? You think SpaceX used this shit to land the Falcon? What, they, they just built 100,000 fake Falcons and crashed them all? They did it in simulation! <laughs> no, they used control theory. Okay, I mean, this kind of sucks. It's not moving. All right. I think it's time. 3E minus 4. It's got to be that. 
Carpathy, come on. 3e minus 4. <laughs> While we watch this thing never actually learn to land, let's think about what other games we could make. Oh, you want to try iterated? You want to try iterated uh, press the light up button where it's a multi-episode game that keeps going? If my schedule is too aggressive, do you want to add the times, uh, the times 0.9 back? We could do that. I mean, it's, it's, it's going up, sort of. That one's going down. That's pretty good. There's also some RNG built into Lunar Lander, which is kind of interesting. Um, I think we should clear the plots. I also think it's getting slower because it's drawing those plots. It's hard to overcome being Lunar Faller. Let's see if that works. CLA? What's the difference between CLA and CLF? This works. The light switch game worked. You can make more complicated versions of the light switch games. Oh yeah, no, I think I met that guy. They have like one like like he's just a genius at controls. It totally makes sense. And they definitely didn't use AI. <laughs> well, we'd be nice to each other on this stream. Only I'm allowed to be me. It's because I have the ban button. I don't know. Who thinks it's eventually going to learn? It's got a lot of parameters, I think. Okay, do they update the target reward based on the actual reward? They do. Okay, we honestly have no idea if the KV cache is working. It, it may just not be working. Which would explain a lot. Like the loss is going down, maybe it'll do something. I don't know if I helps actually. Where did the video go? All right. We should try uh, multi. Uh, I feel like it's not just gonna get it. No, there's still bugs. We definitely still have bugs.
what I'm doing. Target return minus equals observed reward. Add the reward, add the observation, add the action. It's true that if like reward to go is wrong and stuff, none of that will show up in the in the in the light bulb game. Right, okay, bro. Bro, okay. I hooked it up. Get the Xbox controller. Right? Come on, we gotta look good for the video. It loves that that thruster. It's barely using the down thruster. I mean, it is learning and the loss can only go to zero. Good night. Reinforcement learning doesn't work. All right, let's go back to the light bulb game. It's not learning anything. It's like it's learning something here, but what's with the higher learning rate, so? Oh, look, it fired that thruster that time. See, it gives me a little bit of hope. It gives me a little bit of hope that it won't just crash into the ground at full speed. Nope, crashing. Okay, we have to just stop watching it. The number's not gonna go down, okay? It doesn't matter how long you watch it for, the number's not gonna go down. Let's play press the light up button, okay? Now let's add a few parameters to press the light up button. Let's call one of them size and call one of them game length. Confirm we can still learn, press the light up button. Takes a little bit, but now we've learned it, almost. We got it wrong that time. Now we've learned it. Okay, so we do learn to play this game reliably. Now, let's add some complexity to the game. Well, let's start by setting the size to four. Now it has four buttons to choose from. It's a much harder game. Can it still learn to play? Can GPT-2, the whole GPT-2, learn how to play new press the light up button? Okay, it can. So it has no problem with size. Let's increase the game length. Uh, we have to be a little careful now. We want to get a new observation. So we're going to say reward equals self.obs sub act. Step equals zero. Self.reset. And then this is self dot step num less than game. Oh, greater than or equal to. Okay. And 
we broke it. Even though that totally shouldn't matter, we somehow broke the game. Or we just got unlucky. We can go back to size one. By showing a different observation the second time, we break the game. That does not make sense. You can also put the size back. Reason to make it harder than it has to be. I understand press the light up button is a very hard game. Okay, well, that works again. So maybe that wasn't the problem. Maybe the problem was just that it's unreliable with a large size. Large size. Okay, that's fine. All right, so it's unreliable with a large size. Well, that's a different problem. Okay, let's try game length of five. Should be able to get five reward. First time out, it got four reward. Mm, nope, it's very stupid. Okay, well, it definitely can't play this complicated game. I don't think it's a Tiny Grid issue. Like, I, I wrote a bug in Tiny Grid, but Tiny Grid is a very comprehensive test suite. How easy is it to do in PyTorch? Why don't you give it a try? I, I think this has nothing at all to do with PyTorch or Tiny Grid. And everything to do with the fact that machine learning is just mad hard. Okay, let's try a game length of two. Work our way up slowly. Should be able to get two reward now, I think. But yet it can't. Do we have some bug in the game? Let's try some human play of this great game. Okay, one. We should also probably never give reward after the game ends, but I don't think that matters. Now we have a game length of two. Oh, it did get a reward of two once. By sheer luck, and it will never do it again. Larger models are less temperamental. Yeah, that's generally true. All right, let's try a game of size 16. Is this ever going to work? But eventually learn to play this. Now there's 16 buttons, and it has to press the one that lights up. Mm, this is very hard. 
I did get the four though. But yeah, there's definitely something wrong with gaming. So that's interesting. I can't reliably play this game. There's four buttons, guys. You press the one that lights up. It's not that hard. light switch fixed? What do you mean by that? You want to play you want to play the human version of this? Zero. Look, I got reward. Two. Look, I got reward. Two. One. I missed reward. One. I got reward. Three. See, you just press the light up button. Of course, this game is too hard. I just like, if this game's too hard, what can this thing do? Me 12 is like, give it six heads, give it three heads maybe? I don't know, we have too many heads. Okay, that was a stupid guess. Why did I think it had anything to do with heads? Oh, God. Cringe shit. Do you not see the other people posting cringe shit and you're like, I'm gonna come in here and I'm gonna post cringe shit? George? Why? What? What? Do you want do you want to make the, the machine learning work? Do, do you want do you want to make the thing learn how to light press the light up button? people like you see that's that's the really baffling thing this is the most baffling thing about these people like it's it's lemmings it's literally did you not see that guy fall off the cliff did, did you not watch did you not see him fall off the cliff oh dog I'm gonna walk off the cliff too like like what, what are you doing Um, or do you think other people in chat are gonna answer you and anyone in chat who gives who answers these people banned Okay, we're here to play press the light up button, right? Can you play press the light up button? Can you write deep learning to do this? How about three, does three work? We solved it once with four. But that was before we added the game length stuff. I worry that my causal transformer doesn't work. Let's get rid of the JIT again. We definitely don't need that. And we all get 
band. All right, never mind. We need to make the, the press the light up button game work with three actions first. Because this is clearly way too hard. All right. I know, how did anyone get this to work, right? <laughs> Now we can see the probability matrix from that thing. It does look like the right answer is increasing there. Okay, now it's getting two of them correct. No, it just isn't getting this one correct. It's torn between stupid answers. This doesn't really look like a fundamental problem. How do they predict their action? The Hugging Face blog post had some stuff, right? Where's get action? This doesn't return an action, does it? No, okay, do you see the problem here? It's just collapsed very quickly and is never guessing zero for the first one. This one fixed the first one, but now it's struggling with the third one. It's not confident in those answers, but it never predicts that one. All right, let's make the batch size bigger. I don't understand what happens if I, what if I make the temperature greater than one? Oh my God, that's going up now. But in my serious question to the people who come in here and ask for life advice, are you not a frequent watcher of the stream? Now it's solved. I decreased the learning rate and increased the batch size. <laughs> See if I can solve size eight. Or do you think for some reason, I'm gonna give you a different answer? Which is perhaps even more baffling, right? It's, it's not, it's a, it's a dumb question in kind.
You're gonna learn it with five? Oh, you think most people who stream give those answers? I mean, they aren't good questions. Anyone who answers that seriously is doing you a disservice. Can someone who's paying attention explain why people who answer those things are doing people a disservice? Yeah, and, and the, yeah. It's not actually because they're very personal. It, it's actually because the, the biggest problem you have is asking that question. I'm genuinely giving you good advice. The biggest problem you have is coming on the internet asking someone for life advice. Like, like you think that it, that's structurally broken. And I'm sorry other people have taught you to think that way, but until you fix that, you will never make any progress in anything. I mean, you can ask it on the street if you wanna, m most people understand those questions for what they are. And maybe these people do too, it's kind of like a, you know, a shit talking, whatever, man. You know, I'm hanging out at the bus stop. I guess you don't even ask questions like that. I guess, I guess what else upsets me about the questions is you wouldn't ask someone at the bus stop that kind of question. You think that I have some answer for you. I don't, nobody has an answer for you. You're either gonna find the answer yourself or you're gonna die miserable and alone. Now, I don't have experience with being stupid because I am not. It sucks. I mean, I don't know if it sucks, right? I, I think that what sucks is to have ambitions greater than your intelligence. Um, I've met some, I think there's some very happy people who are smart and have low ambition. And these people are just like, yeah, man, everything's just easy. Uh, there's people whose intelligence matches their ambition um, things kind of work out for these people. Who it really doesn't work out for is when they have ambitions here and they're not smart. And like, what can you do? You know, just just be happy that you're not this model that can't even solve. If you're watching streaming, you're above average intelligence. I don't think that's true. Again, I think the internet's gotten really stupid. Uh, but yeah, no, it's, it's, they're shortcutting the learning process. Again, you, you completely misunderstand, you completely misunderstand what learning is. If, if you think there's a way to shortcut it. It's, it's like cheating on a test. Um, they say you should learn how to learn, and that's part of it, but still not all of it. Because then you'll just get the stupid question, well, can you teach me how to learn? And no, nobody can teach you that either. Education, like you can be taught very narrow facts about the world, sure. But again, you don't even be a person anymore. Just go look at, look at my conversation this morning about MOSFETs. People have paralysis with trying. I don't think this is true. I actually think what the problem is, is that they have no gradient. Um, they have no gradient. And just like these models, like this problem is incredibly easy. But it can't learn. We, we can sit here and be like, bro, like, okay, you got the first three, but why can't you output three for the last one? And the probabilities are slowly changing, and maybe someday this model will eventually solve uh, 
press the light up button with four states. The saddest thing is I don't even think there's bugs here. It's gonna it's, it's gonna flip. It's gonna flip. There we go. Zero, one, two, three. And now it gets reward. Well, it doesn't get reward one every time yet. We have to give it a little bit longer for it to stabilize. Okay, so after 500 epochs, it learned how to play press the light up button. Uh, is JIT running again? No, the JIT's turned off, but I think it makes no difference at all. It's just another confounding variable to remove. Uh, I think there is something more structurally broken. Okay, so it can solve size equals four, it just takes a long time. Just like, uh, I think there's something more structurally broken with game length equals two. You do think learning to learn is part of the problem. Uh, people give up when they see people like me who started young as shit and have a lot of talent. Yeah, I mean, the truth is some, most people should probably give up. The, 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 the truth is if you're... Uh, and again, this is not advice that someone's going to tell you. But if you're 25 and you... It's not like if you're 25 and you can't program, if you like uh, have aptitude with physics or philosophy or, or math, right? Like if you have strong aptitude in another area and you just didn't put time into programming, then yeah, perhaps you can learn to program. But ask yourself that honestly, do you have, did, did you, uh, how did you do on, how did you do on your math SAT? It's that stupid, right? If you got if you got a, a, a 450 on your math SAT, you're not gonna learn to be a great programmer at 25. You're just not. That's that's the reality of it. Am I am I good at, at STEM? Ask me a question. Ask me a science question. Don't ask me if I'm good at STEM. Don't trust me to evaluate myself. Who knows? That's just stunning Kruger. You can't ask someone if they're good at something. Why is this model not good at solving two-step? I wonder if it's a KV cache. For some reason we're not incrementing. Prove the irrationality of the square root of two. Uh, <laughs> in cock, I actually did that. That's, that's, I have that on my uh, my thing. I saw I saw a Taylor Swift proves the irrationality of the square root of two. Oh, people should ask themselves that. I mean. Again, but like this is just this is just a, a complete it's a complete circle jerk. Uh, n nobody who's any good at things sits around and talks like this. And if you are talking like this, I don't think it's going to get better for you, or at least not what you're trying. Uh, I have a contiguous after the KV cache. Yeah, I'm going to try disabling the KV cache. I mean, the KV cache definitely works in GPT-2. And welcome, host pack. Um, yeah, I have a contiguous there. So, I guess, like, how does it not even get it wrong accidentally half the time? That's the weirder thing. 
What is it outputting? Suddenly, I put one thing. Wait, it's terminated already? No, that seems broken. Okay, we had a bug and press the light up button, if you can believe it. But now we're still getting false, false there. Why is that loop exiting? God, I can't believe, I actually had a bug and press, and press the light up button. Bike shedding, guys. Bike shedding. Uh, okay. Terminated and not truncated. Loop through there. Why is that not printing a second action? Or it, um. <sighs> I mean, to be fair, this was just a bug with my implementation of a uh, of press light up button and not a bug with uh, Okay, will it learn to play two steps? It's slowly learning. I had to lower the learning rate to get it to learn the big size ones. Should we have early termination if you lose? We could probably do that. Uh, so if you lose. Okay, so I guess this can be truncated and then done goes here. If not reward, self dot done equals true. Okay. Now the episode name will change. Put the. Oh, you want me to add a failure reward? I don't know if you need a failure reward. 
Um, okay, let's try a game length of five. And we'll put the learning rate back up to something reasonable. Oh, yo, give me McFlurry, bro. No, like literally, I'd love McFlurry right now. Is it gonna learn how to get good reward here? Interesting. It learns how to get three reward and then it stops. Let's see my ID. Uh, oh, I'm so glad I got a new ID. My ID's been expired for a while. Okay, it learned how to get three reward. I don't know if it just like stops at three. I'll point out also we haven't fixed any real bugs in it. Nor did it maybe got five? No. It learns how to get one from the top. Interesting. I wonder if that like means something. I wonder if it's trying for that somehow. Yeah, tendies! Is the model using cash? Yeah, it is. Again, this is a totally stateless game. Um, all right, you guys wanna try a new game? Will you have to guess the state? To see if it's doing time stuff correctly? It just, it just tests sequential actions? It's interesting that it converges to four. I wonder if that's like fundamental or A lower learning rate, it's worse. Yeah, I think banned. Is that the same guy who posted before? Dumb crap. Dumb crap. It's dumb. It's dumb. Start with a timeout. Uh, okay. See, that's interesting. It learns, and then it must be when it subtracts the reward. Like, it must actually be learning to do badly on the last one. Do I have an off by one error somewhere? Okay, let's try a few things. Let's always shoot for a little bit higher than the highest reward. I don't know what that's gonna do. I just not learn anything. Can these all like, this is all just out of distribution at that point. It's like, it's, it's shooting for 5.5. Oh, well, that's the best I've seen it do. Okay, that's pretty good. It solved it. We shoot for a little bit higher 
than than the highest reward. Now these are still state independent, so like we could get trickier with this game. Like it has to learn the stuff offset by one. All right, well, we'll just add. We'll add something here called hard mode. Um, in hard mode, the correct action is actually the action plus the step number mod self.size. All right, let's see if we can as a human play it in hard mode. Okay, uh, the answer is one. The answer here, they want you to think is zero, but it's actually one. Wait, no, that was wrong. Oh, because we're not in hard mode. Let's go to hard mode. One. The answer they want you to think is one, but it's actually zero. No. Well, should have been that. So that should have been step, step num zero. Oh, also if self dot hard mode. No, it's not respecting hard mode. Step zero it shouldn't be. I incremented the step num here. Uh, oh, am I resetting every time? Yeah, I'm resetting every time. Play the game on hard mode. You guys see how hard mode works? I feel like I probably wrote this exact same game last time, like with all the same stuff. Does it ever learn hard mode? the first step reliably why is it not actually taking that first step reliably then why does sometimes it get zero reward it seems extremely confident in the first step Hard mode's a little too hard for it. I don't know. I'm interested to plug in, press the light up button into all like the RL stable baselines things. I'd be curious to see someone do it. Like can PPO solve this? How is it ever getting a reward of zero? Just shouldn't be. No, nope, hard mode's too hard for it. Not hard mode?
better than that. There's a five you can get to. I mean, actually, we're asking it to play long games. So let's give it a game length of 32. Because it's really a max game length. Yeah, I don't know. You can try that some other stream. Like there's lots of different variants of this game that are, are quite interesting. It's only getting to nine. Can't do better? It's confident there now. Got to nine. Oh yeah, like like a a, 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 ta a table based algorithm will solve this instantaneously. <laughs> Why doesn't reinforcement learning work? Oh, part of the reason this doesn't work is because target return is one. Part of the reason that's reliable. And sometimes it does does worse is because even though that's I don't know. Just want like a like a discount factor on the subtraction. Where's a rollout? What if I do that? There's no excuse for not doing well on the first one. I mean, it, it occasionally gets it. It's just not reliable. I feel like I'm missing something. I mean, I see no reason. Like, this game's going to struggle once it gets to... The game length is 32, bro. Keep going. You can do better. You'll never do better now. Like, it's a pretty good agent, but it peaks there. It's because when it gets to the last one, it's in a fixed state. Okay, I have an idea. So you don't get stuck. Subtract a random amount of reward. It can't just be that. Target return.
Torch cat, target return. Oh, what is this scale? What is this? That, that's exactly what I was doing. Where does that come from? The word scale doesn't appear anywhere else in here. Yeah, then I gotta set that up. What do you think, I'm good at computers? I'm not, okay? That's a lie. So wh wh where do I get this scale from? Well, look, I, I told you. I told you this had to be in here. This is, okay, now, now we're in bullshit land of RL. Like, it's mostly correct, but... Hey, Marcel Bischoff. Um, if you check the GitHub, it's there. Where? Ask Quentin. Quentin's... I'm over Quentin. Scale equals... No, 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 no. Scale can't equal a thousand. That doesn't make sense. Decision transformer. Show me where scale equals a thousand. I'm not I'm not asking a model. It doesn't make sense. Run decision transformer. Row ninety-three. Normalization. Oh. Okay, well, that's actually not what I thought it was then. That's stupid. I mean, that's just because regression's hard, but we don't really care about that. We actually don't care about that at all. Um, okay, so that wasn't what I thought it was. What did we have the most, the best results with? We had the best results was just multiplying it by a little something. Because we wanted to do a little better, you know? Like every everybody's gotta move up in the world, you know? Move, move a little past their, their, their parents' generation or whatever. Everyone's gotta move up in the world. You're 5% better than anything you've seen before. Try penalizing it if it gets stuck. All right, good, carrots and sticks, I love it. I don't know how to do that. Reinforcement learning just doesn't work. This whole thing's broken. Humans don't do this crap. If it gets down, if it if it learned the whole thing before it uh I mean, okay, part of the problem now is that this thing's just too simple. So, you know, like the failed self-driving car company. Um, so let's go back to Lunar Lander and let's see if we can make it land. Like the old days, boys, like the old days. Um, okay, well, let's, let's try a little more, press light up button, uh, just to make sure the JIT works okay. I don't think there's anything wrong with the jet. Hearing 10 hours, all right. Reinforcement learning is addictive because it never works. Mm, yeah, okay, that's just because of this again. What? Missing mismatch of var vowels. Uh, I don't know about that. Looks like some JIP problem. How come I didn't see that when I was using the JIP before? Oh, 
forward jit dot reset. Am I actually resetting? Oh, it's because I have this. Yeah, gets a little faster with the jet. Learn nothing faster. It converges to a point where the loss is low, and yeah, it converges to something like that. Come on, just beat that now. Right, let's play with our model a little. Maybe the model will make a little better. Uh, didn't be bigger. We definitely don't need that. I'll give it four layers. I mean, it learns so fast. Come on, do better than four. But it has no incentive now to do better. Yeah, the loss gets low and then it like stops caring. Like nothing improves after the loss is low. It's just learn to predict everything in the uh Okay, I mean another fix for this potentially is where do I have first? We can just as a ratio, all right? You can decide how many. You can decide, like now I'm doing two episodes for each. So maybe the loss won't go to zero as fast. Useless. I mean, okay, we can inject variance by lowering the batch size. That's pretty much the same thing as messing with the learning rate. I open. You have to push down. Thank you. We got candies and mozzarella. Okay, well, lowering the batch size made it worse. Lowering the batch size made it way worse. So, you know what that makes me think? Increasing the batch size will make it better. Look, it just improved. Can I do better than that? Why does it stop at seven? There's nothing special about seven. Now let's try, let's target a 3% GDB increase. 3%. Let's target a 3% increase.
But we also, we have to be a little careful with this. I actually want to say highest reward plus highest absolute value of highest reward. Throw a little additive in there too. I don't know, something like 0.1. That one is nothing. Oh, I uh, went crazy there. I meant that. Since 128 is divisible by eight, I don't think so, bro. We also add some RNG to that. And now we reach for something that's a little random. Minus one. Come on, go up. Keep going. Keep going. You got this, boy. You don't got this. something can it learn to play the game in hard mode Hard mode has like polarity and stuff. Universal function approximated my ass. To be fair, these are the kind of things that uh, that uh, the other kind of functions deep learning is very bad at. Sometimes don't do your best.
Hard pull is impossible. Lunar Lander. Why is it out putting twos with it never sees in the data set? Okay, I think machine learning is impossible. This just doesn't work. This doesn't work. I'm sure I have tons of bugs still. I think this is a final attempt. Tomorrow we'll try again. We'll look at some repos that actually work. Okay, okay. The loss is going down, the reward is going up. I think that it's just become lunar faller. Yep. All right, just escape that local minima. is it's just showing it the same data over and over again which I mean this should be an offline all right now we've gone into this mode where we just fire the right thruster how did anyone get this to work
it learned anything? Like, it all just looks so easy that they draw that picture. And then you think, oh, I'll just implement that. But you won't. Hmm. What do they use for K? We feed it the last K time steps. I wonder if this actually helps. What's K? The blade on the context length K. What do they use for K? No, these things work. There's just bugs. <sighs> They're not debuggable. Which is the most annoying thing. Falling's pretty good. Oh, here we go. We use context length of k equals 30. Which is interesting. I've tried like the stable baseline stuff to get something that works, and I've had no luck. <coughs> I think we tried this for a while. I don't think this works. Let's spend 30 minutes and see if we can get beautiful cart bowl to become, I mean, I'm sure it works. I don't know where my bugs are. There's so much that we have to test and so much that we just need better introspection for. That tiny grad needs better introspection for. Um, so I, I wrote this. Uh, this is beautiful cart bowl. Uh, it's an example in TinyGrad, and it actually is an example of working RL. Um, it uses PPO. And now, let's see if we can change the environment name to Lunar Lander. And let's see if we can make it work.
This one does work at Carpole, at least. It's good to have something that works. I've solved Lunar Lander before with, with PPO. Okay. Uh, let's train for way longer than 40. Let's try 400. Because it's fast too, which is nice. It's quickly losing episodes now. Let's see if it comes back. Longer replay buffer. Let's tweak hyperparameters until it learns. losses are really high it might be too aggressive with the landing rate I get rid of the replay buffer thing Let's try 200 now see look it takes some bad step and then it just starts losing entirely Get rid of reward to go. I'm oh, sorry, not reward to go. Let's go to discounting. What does this do now? I think it just. I think it nanned out. Maybe that's when it fills the replay buffer. It takes less action. Yeah, that probably makes sense. Once it reaches the replay buffer, it's fast. Okay, that makes a lot of sense, actually. Um, but sorry, you don't get to be fast. Because it has to do, it has to do compilation until it hits the uh, the right size. You could fix that with variables. I'm sure RLlib works kind of if you set the hyperparameters to what they to what they demand them to be. I don't know. Maybe tomorrow we'll we'll take a look at other people's RL code and see what we can replicate. Uh, is, uh, why does MNIST work and RL not work?
No, the answer is not because RL has too many hyperparameters. Ooh, entropy loss. Let's change that. I mean, it can't just be that it has too many hyperparameters, right? MNIST has all those hyperparameters too. MNIST is just stable across a wide variety of them. But there's not that many hyperparameters that are unique to RL. <coughs> the critic loss is really high. Oh, we might also have to scale these rewards to not be such large numbers. I don't know how it manages to do so much worse than just falling. At least the other one learned how to fall. This one, I don't know what it's learning. But it's fast. Critic loss too high. What does it do after all that? Oh yeah, great. Good move, bro. Good move. It's almost like it wants the reward to be big. To make the hidden state a lot bigger. <coughs> this isn't cart pull. Those are very simple models. It's unclear if they can learn it, that might be the problem. But no, it's probably not that. I don't know. You can solve this with like meat and three neurons. Um, all right. Guess what? We're going to stream tomorrow too, and we're going to make this work. It's just so frustrating. I think, has anyone tried, has anyone made like dumb gym games that are just like way stupider? I go, well, this doesn't work either. So that sucks. We'll put back beautiful carpool. That one at least solves carpool. To be fair, this algorithm does better than that. It learns how to become lunar faller. To be fair, I wonder if it would be better with entropy regularization. Where's the, where's the app? I don't know if letting it train overnight is going to help. I mean, it can't solve this simple. It can't solve those simple environments. Which is a bigger problem. Has anyone done that before?
very complex. Every time we try to do RL on stream, oh, I'm not trying some stupid hyperparameter optimization. Like this is exactly the problem. Every time we try to do our own stream, we just end up frustrated and angry. This stuff just doesn't really work. Maybe some very careful implement implementations of it do, but Box 2D is a Pygame Pi game library, I think, yeah. The loss calculation and update? Well, yeah, the update's the most important part. No shit, the update's the most important part of all of learning. The update is what learning is. Sorry, is that where my head is? Can you not see that graph not go up? And I thought we were gonna get Pokemon playing on a tiny box. We can't even get Lunar Lander to work. We can't even get the button game to work. Yeah, I've seen that one. Why are LLMs bad? Because the RL doesn't work. Oh, today was a shitty live stream. Today was a shitty stream. We started off. We started off strong with some good rants. We, we, we smoked some weed. We had high hopes, and what actually happened? The thing didn't even like. Like it just it doesn't land. I don't know how to fix it. Uh, there's a million places bugs can be. They're probably in all of those places, plus 10 more I didn't think of. Um, like it's not just gonna start learning. It can't learn, it can't learn how to get past the seventh step of the button game. I'm not pushing this to GitHub. This sucks too much. We'll stream again tomorrow. Maybe. I might have something to do tomorrow. If I don't have anything to do tomorrow, I'll stream again. Try again. We'll go very nice and slow. We'll try introspection. Like the usual techniques. What time tomorrow, dude? I don't... Just 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 don't 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 trigger me right now, man. Oh, I, I thought, oh, we'll just get a transformer. Oh, we'll just get a transformer. It'll be easy. Oh, it's just like supervised learning. Well, it's not like supervised learning because your shitty model changes the distribution of the shitty data. Wow, I never realized that the ground changed shape. I wonder if that's put in. Is that put into the state? Sure you walk, sure you dare. I don't know, you wanna, you wanna just sit here and watch it learn for a little bit? So there's just eight observations, so it doesn't tell you how bumpy the ground is. Maybe one of the observations is like how close you are to the ground or something. Ugh, 
I could try implementing it with PyTorch. Did, did any of the... Did, you know, I, I've so... <sighs> What's my take on the future of web dev? No. Uh, no, the words are still true, but I, I am in a, I'm in a bad mood that it doesn't that this doesn't work. And like I probably have bucks, I probably have just tons of bucks, and we'll all be equal when we're dead. That's true. That's true. Except this model, this model is still gonna suck more than everybody when it's dead. Um, just just land the thingy. Just 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 land it, bro. Just you can do it. To be fair, this does look a lot more stable, at least, than PPO. It's a cool idea. We, 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 learned, we learned something cool today. We learned that about how decision transformers work. And who knows, if you get everything right, maybe it just works. The loss is going down, which is interesting. This thing is, this big transformer is learning a model of how the world works. Just, just leave it. It's just like my computer tries to land. Did that, did, that, did that increase the thing? Look, it increased right there. It went up a tiny bit. Do we get the press button game working? Yeah, but not the hard edition of it. We got some simple variants of it working sometimes. But I think we should formalize the press button game. Formalize the press button game. We'll see what else can play it. To be fair, I haven't done much transformer training at all. Yeah, I played Breath of the Wild last night. Where's my Switch controller? Should we play some Breath of the Wild and be bad at that? Oh. Yeah, this is what we did. Look, it doesn't work. Like, the thing doesn't land. I have to do some real soul searching after this. No, I don't. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just mad RL doesn't work. Like, you see the DeepMind robots playing soccer? They did that by... <sighs> no, nobody's gotten this stuff right. Like, RL doesn't work anywhere. Why are there no robots cooking and cleaning? And it's because this stuff, like, it's a... No, I... Yeah, I worked in robotics, too. Trust me, I know it's all fake. Like, comma works through so much careful testing and, like... Like, like so much just... Testing and tweaking. Why do I just believe that it's going to get better soon? I just believe that like, oh, it's going to learn how to land. But like, it's not. This is a problem. Kami uses RL. No, we don't use RL because RL doesn't work. We, we wasted, we wasted six months last year on RL. And Kama has stuff. We have, we, like all our stuff works with Lunar Lander and and cart pole, and we have something that can kind of drive the car with RL. It can go straight on the highway, but like, it's just way worse than everything else. 
figure robot tweet says they have an RL breakthrough? Can they solve the button pressing game? Can their thing just one shot the button pressing game? Um, I've seen Mobile Aloha. Uh, the videos are cool, but yeah, like all demos, what's real, what's sped up? Um, it is cool though. And like, I think that is a lot of the right approach to uh, doing the like doing cooking and stuff is to first set up a very good uh they, they have like their their rig has like four hands on it it's got like two hands on the front and then two places you put your hands and you can manipulate the the rig okay <sighs> we'll try to stream again tomorrow we're gonna make this work we're not gonna lose we, we are going to make the lunar lander land if, if you want more content, you're in luck because you get more content when shit doesn't work. We're in a bad mood. Nothing you can do about that. Gen 7th. It's... it's I'm not frustrated that this code doesn't work. I, I'm frustrated that I, I feel like all of the introspection tools that I would need to debug this just don't exist. Uh, it's As far as I know, unless something's really changed recently, it's not any better in PyTorch. Uh, do you remember my Muse Zero stream? I just failed at that. I don't think I ever got that Mu Zero to, to, I did not get it to solve Lunar Lander. It just didn't work. Uh, which is, which is just frustrating. And then even Beautiful Card Pole, we have Beautiful Card Pole in there. It only solves it like 75% of the time. Uh, I do think that another problem might be that my initialization is bad. That that Torch has better initialization. So that's one thing that might be different about Tiny Grad and Torch. RL is so hard and stupid. Yeah, but without our uh, we were talking at lunch a few days ago, like RL is RL is consciousness. If there's anything that is consciousness, it's 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 having a model of yourself in the environment. And you'll never do that with supervised learning. You'll never understand that you are the agent. You need RL for that. So this has to work. All right, I'm tired. I'll try again tomorrow. Yeah, I know the Mu Zero streams are massive because I, pro I probably got equally frustrated by the same garbage. Like, why won't you just, just, just like land between the flags, bro? Land between the flags. All right. We'll make it work. <laughs>